crunch time. That's what time it is. Hi. Mal will be here in a minute. She's just finishing up. How is everybody today? How is how is everybody's Thanksgiving? That's a good question. <laughs> Honk. Hopefully everyone had a, a good Thanksgiving. Ours was uh ours was really well. My apologies to the Canadians. <laughs> Although you can still talk about your <laughs> Thanksgiving from, what, a month ago? Ours was really good. We had a, we had, we had a really good Thanksgiving. Uh, Lindsay and her mom were over, and then we also had Will, because his family uh, was in... His family's in Georgia, and he didn't have anyone to spend uh, Halloween with. And was, Halloween. <laughs> Cross the wires. He didn't have anyone to spend Halloween with. So he joined us for Thanksgiving. As you've probably... Uh, <laughs> I'm thankful for skeletons. As you've probably already seen, uh, we've we've changed the 300-bit alert to a honk. Hi, Mal. Um, yesterday we had changed it to a, uh, a turkey. And I was like, well, let's keep the bird theme. So now it's... Now it's uh, it's a goose. It's a goose honk. So not only will, you know, we be honking in tonight the game. in the mm -hmm. game, but you guys can honk too. And it'll be very confusing because it's literally <laughs> the same honk. It's the exact same honk. <laughs> so we'll see how, uh, how, that, how that goes. <laughs> anyway, so we're starting a little bit earlier so we, uh, so we can read a few alerts. And I've been charging the controller a little bit. It's probably good now. Yeah. It's probably good now. So let's read a, let's read a few alerts here before we jump in. This is going to be a super casual stream. <laughs> as you probably expected. <laughs> Hallelujah. Uh-huh. Um, we're just really... We, it was... It's not that yesterday was stressful. Yesterday was no. easy. Yeah. Um, it was the, the preparation. The for preparation yesterday. of yesterday. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Quite a bit. Although one of the themes of yesterday, Thanksgiving, was giving, giving gift subs, and it looks like yeah, that's continuing <laughs> today. Look at this: ten gift subs from Romulus Magnus, and we're still—it's still close enough. I'm gonna say Happy Thanksgiving, you. Happy Thanksgiving, you Romulus. Appreciate it. Let's um, let's 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 read some of these things, real quick before we jump in. We got subs from Mercy Anomaly, Death Ray Duelist. Got a 13 on 3 sub from Zarin. There's another 10 gift subs from Hotex Page. Happy Thanksgiving, you Hotex Happy Page. Happy Thanksgiving, you Hotex Page. I appreciate that. I'm, I'm on my way up. Uh, 300 bits from Wolves of Pie says, For science, which alert is it? You figured it out. <laughs> I decided to keep it the same. I thought 300 bits was a good, uh, good fit for that. Maybe we can just start changing it, depending on, like, the game. Because it's so hard to re to redo all of the alerts yeah. for a game. It's really difficult. But to do one... Themed for the game. I thought is, is really yeah, nice. So bad. I mm -hmm. think I think I'm going to try and do that, if I can, you know, for our gaming streams from now on. So, uh, wish me luck on that. 300 bits seems like a good fit for that, too. Also got a sub from uh, Rysik312. And a two-month sub from The James Rolls, who says... Honk. honk. If anyone's joining us and they don't understand the honk thing... Don't worry, you'll get it soon. You're going to get it, and also I'm really excited, because this this is truly, truly blind for you. Maybe you've only heard the name of the game, and you're not really familiar with what to expect. And that's that's exciting. My first time seeing it was when Dan played it. Really? Yes. Okay. Yeah, so um, this is going to be basically a blind playthrough for us. Another happy Thanksgiving, you... You're right. There's another five subs from Hotex page. Happy Thanksgiving, you. The thanking is a little less aggressive today. A I got all my less. I got all my aggression this out piano yesterday. The music is it. I, it's calming. calming. It's yeah. calming. Yeah. It's it's the music is absolutely affecting 
the manner at which I speak. Music is so powerful. Um, what was I saying? Right prior. Oh, the the we've we've managed to play. Well, did you play it? No, I didn't play it either. I did. Okay, so technically, yeah, neither of us have ever played Untitled Goose Game. Paul visited in October. I think it was October. Or September. One of the two. And he brought um, Untitled Goose Game, and we saw the beginning of it played. Dan played it, and he was so entertaining, we just let him play. I was like, I, I don't want to play. <laughs> it I just really want to watch you watch play Dan it. It was really great to watch Dan play. I kind of wish we had it recorded. Yeah, but um, we've only seen the very, very beginning of the game, so it's. I would still call this a blind playthrough. It should be pretty... Uh, Pretty enjoyable. 300 bits from Chemist 2020. Hi, Stephen and Mao. I'm super excited that you guys are going to be playing this game. I'd like to stay around, but I have my own stream to set up for. We'll definitely be watching Devod later. Well, thank you, Chemist, and good luck with your stream. I got 1,000 bits from Game Boy 18. Two things. Checking to see if other alerts have changed. And recent. I recently started watching Walking Dead again. What was the reason for the immediate hate for Duck? <laughs> I don't know. I don't remember. <laughs> it's, I don't know if it was based on anything or it's just like throwing a dart at a dartboard and someone has to get picked. It's like, oh, we landed on, we landed on Duck. Maybe Duck was just too cheery for the apocalypse. Maybe. Maybe that was it. Um, either way, Mr. Game Boy, thank you for the bits. And uh, just so there is no confusion, the only alert that has changed from other gaming alerts has been the honk sound at 300. Yes. Read the Nintendo Painter gives a sub to Honk Honk Goose Man. It's a good name. Seven months from uh, Konosuga says... Yonk, yonk, am Goose. Just moved to Florida to start a new chapter in my life and get some mental health help. I'm really looking forward to it, and I hope you two have a great holiday season. Well, thank you. So far, so good. Yeah. Um, there has been, a, uh, I would say, a lack of sleep in the last week. Yeah. Um, which is really unusual. Like, there's been less sleep in the last week than there has, like, for the whole year. Mm -hmm. And yet, I'm at peace and calm because... I so know, much is done. Yeah, there's a lot done, and I'm looking I at the. I feel so good. I'm looking at the future, yeah. and I'm like, oh. And we hung lights up okay. today. Yeah. Also, there's so many people I think that lose out on some sleep around Thanksgiving time, especially especially if you're cooking or traveling or traveling. Mm -hmm. um, and for Mal, I mean, she, how many, you made four pies. Four pies. And you're gonna and make, another to make another one tomorrow. One tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Dan was out of town. Spending time with his family. He's yeah. coming back into town tomorrow. And uh, he was like, will there be any pie left? Apple, specifically. And Mao was like, I'll make another pie. <laughs> and he was just... That was... that was Just to make sure Dan gets some pie. The most exciting thing for him. You know what this music reminds me of? Low-key? Um, Solo piano radio? I was going to say Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. A little bit, yeah. So it's it's It sounds... That's what it... A little bit. It's got that... That same feel. It's really nice. Um, let's see here. Do do do. I got 12 months for Kaze Ninja 17. Kaze, thank you. I appreciate it. Three months. That's a plus from uh, Mister Misters V1. It says, "Keep up the great work, guys. Thank you. We're gonna we're gonna try. We're gonna try." Also, I saw some people saying, "Did, did the is the is the honking still working?" Right now, I think it's on the sub crunch. Okay. I heard the honks, so they were working. Hopefully, they don't break. Can we open the door? Jeff yeah. said he's covered in cats, and I I could use a Sagan. I mean, yeah. That, that's fine. Okay. We'll do... Are you doing now? Okay. No, you do it. Okay. Whenever you get a chance. Okay. Whenever you get a chance. Whenever. So we have pie for later. Yeah. We gotta finish it so I can have a pie tin to make more pie. Yeah, there's 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 a hundred percent chance of pie being eaten on this stream. Just want everyone to know that we we still have a great deal of pie. We got eleven months from brother one uh, one four eight four says honk. Glad to be able to catch the stream tonight. Glad you're here, brother. Uh, Fifteen months in a row from Louvital honk. It's good timing. It's like yesterday with the goose gobble or the the turkey gobble. I'm confusing all my birds. It's the same thing today. Read the Nintendo Bader, uh gifts a tier 3 sub to E. Good Tyler Mythical and Invisible Platinum Toast. Read, thank you. I appreciate that. We've got um, four months. You, you just, you literally brought him in. Hi, bud! If you could, you would attack a goose. Yeah. Yeah. They've seen Canadian geese. And they weren't thrilled. 
Hi, Six. Come lay down. Or just stand where you are. That's fine, too. Come on. Hi, bud. It's a beautiful day oh, in、I've、the neighborhood.、Chosen. A beautiful、Hello. day. Four months up from、uh, Wall and Hornigan, who says,、uh, I'll be in VOD Squad today as it's approaching 2 a.m. here, but have a honking good time. We'll do our best. We'll do our best. Please don't rub your face on that. Please don't. Call him back. He wants on your lap. You want my lap? Come here, baby. Come here. Do it. <laughs> you, you won't. Come on, Sakes. My God. <laughs> He's got to walk around. Okay. Three and a bit from Wolves of Pie. Wrong. It is honk time. It is honk time. Honk. Honk. Three and a bit from Mr. Game Boy 18. Honk, honk. Knowing you are usually there when the timer goes down, what would you do if a song happens? <sighs> I, just, I just prepare the best I can. The best I can. Three months from、uh, Fro Rewolf. Thank you, Fro Rewolf. 15 months from Ultra Husk. Honk. With a.、Uh, was that Umlaut? The two the dots?、O's? Yeah, those yeah, are Umlauts. Umlauts.、Uh, Bear Link gives us up to Honk, putting Honk at two months. <laughs> it's, not our, it's not our first、uh, Honkio. <laughs> Honk rodeo, honky. Okay. 300 bits from Bear Link. Honk check. <laughs> They're working. Five months from、uh, Incomplete Mess. Merry Honk Miss.、Uh, to one and all. Hope you had a good turkey day. Just a couple of poultry days. Okay. I'll stop. Incomplete Mess. Not a complete mess. Tier 2 sub. Five months. Romulus Magnus. Good evening, Stephen Amal. Looking forward to tonight's game. Happy American Thanksgiving. Well, thank you, Romulus. Thank you for the,、uh, the Tier 2 sub. Happy gold toast to you. <laughs> honk! <laughs> Moist Crunchy Potato gives a sub to Honk! See, that one is the first time that they've gotten a sub.、Mm -hmm. Honk with multiple O's. Thank you, Potato. Hotex Page、uh, sends 300 bits, no message, although it did produce a honk. 300 bits also for Phantom SVT. Happy Halloween, Stephen Amal, and maybe Thanksgiving too. While、well, you, I think you were gone, but、um, I messed up. What holiday it was. <laughs> I said,、um, I said, Will didn't have anyone to spend Halloween with. <laughs> it sounds sadder and more pathetic with this music playing, I promise. It, it wasn't that bad.、Uh, Trainer Mang resubscribes for 15 months. Appreciate it, Trainer.、Uh, Romulus Magnus 10's gift subs went to Liz Ikanaka,、uh, Tay the Femme, Mercury Adept,、uh, Aaron Tiki. Ice Cold, 120,000, Link Haxor, Yellow Salt 2, PK Sandman, Cora Luna, and Zyke Strike. Thank you, Romulus. Happy Deer 2, resubscribe for 12 months. That's a year. Have a, have a jazzy clap. Really love this music. Hotex Page、uh, with、uh, 10 subs to 09 Murphy M, Little Squirrel 55, Crystal Clear Animations, Alf U,、uh, Sybil Yek, Joseph A. Kelly. Prince Riku, Lionheart, Ghosty, Toasty, JC4R, and Forever His Angel. Thank you, Hotex. Ghosty Toasty 3 is a good username. It's a good username. Three months from Bray Lara, who says, Yay, subs! Congrats on a plus. 300 bits from Wolves of Pie. Happy Honksgiving, you. That's true. True. Honks, I should say Honksgiving, you today.、Uh, five gift subs from Hotex again. It says,、uh, going to Revigilant, Delfino Luma, Mario Luigi. And George GW. Oh, and traveling through Aldra because I can only count to four. Screen wants to dim, and I'm like, don't you do it. Don't you? I'm watching you, screen.、Uh, near in the end here, we got a bunch of people honking. <laughs> It's fun to honk.、Um, maybe not quote me on that. 300 bits from Jam. Honk! And still snowy, but the roads are finally normal. Hope you like the goose of fame that knows no name, and hope you survived the pipocalypse with hunger annihilated.、Uh, we did. Hunger is never annihilated. Well, okay, actually, annihilate is a good word. It's annihilated, but then also some. Thanksgiving is the time of year when you are done eating, but there's still more food, and you are like, it tastes good. And you put just a little just too much, one more a little too much in, and、yeah. one more roll. Basically, another scoop of sweet potatoes. Basically, basically that.、Um, and also,、uh, while, while we're on the subject, special thanks to Jam, because Jam is the individual who gifted us Untitled, Untitled Goose, Goose Game. Game. So、mm -hmm. shout out to Jam, and thank you, Jam, for making this stream a reality. 
Uh, Jam has actually really wanted us to play Untitled Goose Game for a while, um, which aligned well with what I wanted to do, which was play Untitled Goose Game at some point. And that's happening tonight. And I think it's it's actually very fitting, too. Yeah. That it's it's happening after Thanksgiving. From one bird to another. <laughs> Except for not eating the goose. Uh, maybe at the end you eat the goose. Probably not. Uh, we got 100 bits from Wolf Dragonblood. Thank you, Wolf. 14 months from Luke a lot. <laughs> Honk! So many honks. 300 bits from Wandering Stars. Happy Honk-a-days! <laughs> you can just insert honk wherever you want. 300 bits from Hotex Page. More honking. 300 bits from Princess Pika 94. Happy Friday, grandparents. Looking forward to winding down a busy day with lots of laughs. And we're looking forward to getting our PS4 bundle early next week. I can finally play Horizon Zero Dawn. I haven't played that, but I've heard extremely good things. Extremely good things. Uh, 300 bits from Somber Make 91. Gobble, gobble, honk, honk. <laughs> when the birds meet. 300 bits also from Gold Mage 162. If the honk is the same as Gobble from yesterday, does that mean this stream will be an extra hour longer than it should be on account of honking? Uh, well, I will be reading alerts throughout. Mm -hmm. uh, alerts will not be paused for this stream. We're just going to clear up the queue before we get started. Be. So I don't think so. I think I'll be able to we'll be able to keep up on it. Under bits from Wondering uh, Wonder Gaming 1999. Thank you, Wonder. Two months from King Sal. That's Will, <laughs> who needed someone to spend Halloween with. <laughs> Thank you, Will. I think Sagan just dove off the stairs after Kepler. That sounds right. Do you know where the thing is? No, I don't know where it You're is. You're going to need to find that. It's yours. It's up here. It's yours. It's right there. Okay, cool. You'll have to get it. You can grab it. No, you can grab you it. You can get it. No. It's okay. I'll let you. Three months from Avgis, our name. Wow, look. I'm at three months. I've only watched a few streams, but I'm happy to be here. We're happy you're here, too. We're going to have a good time and, and honk at some, uh, some gardeners. They're into bits from Phantom SVT, but really, it's been an amazing Thanksgiving for me, as I've been able to get out and see family for, for, for the first time in a few years. I hope everyone else here has enjoyed their Thanksgiving or Thursday. <laughs> and also, if you had Taco Bell for Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. I hope you enjoyed it. Phantom SVT, I'm glad to hear that. Um, it's, it's, a, it's also an interesting feeling, I think, if it's been a few years since you've seen family. Mm -hmm. um, for me, it, it kind of has been. Like when we took our little trip and we drove up and came down and saw everyone in, when was that? Last year? Which trip? <laughs> when we saw like my, my family and stuff. Oh, that one. Yes. That was last year. Oh, wait. No, no. Was that two years? No. That was older than that, I think. I think that might have been two years. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's just a weird feeling when you get to see people. But I hope that it was a good feeling. 13 months from Joe89. Lucky 13, have fun honking. <laughs> <laughs> you can't plan these things. No. You can't plan these things. Seven months from Wonder Gaming 1999. If I had a honk. Mm, nope. <laughs> Three and a bit from Mr. Game 18. As I plan uh, your usual song for me, I have to ask Will alerts be paused? Alerts are not paused. Alerts are not paused. So we are reading and reacting to things throughout the game. Mm -hmm. uh, we got 1962 bits from Hotex Page, who says, Time for some Taco Bell. Hotex, thank you. I appreciate that. We got 300 bits from Bear Link. I saw Honkleton, Hamilton, on Wednesday, and it was really uh, interesting getting to see a crowd in Virginia. It took, uh, took a lot of the historical lines making fun of Virginian historical figures. Everyone should see it if you get the chance. I've heard only great things about Hamilton. Mm -hmm. And also... The musical. Yeah. <laughs> 300 bits from Gold Mage who says, uh, You were also reading alerts throughout yesterday's stream. In fact, it's pretty much all you did. Barely had time for stories, toast, or liquid turkey. Honk, 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 honk. Nickelodeon. <laughs> Thank you, Gold Mage. We're all caught up. Yeah. Time to start. I think it's time to start. I so, think so too. So here's how we're going to do it. Like I said, um, I'm not. Uh, I'm not going to pause alerts mm -hmm. for this, so they'll just be on. Uh, like, you can honk anytime you want. Uh, you can honk if you want to. You can leave your friends behind. It's hard to make that work with this music play. I know. You can honk if you want to, uh, and we're going to be uh, trading off on every task. Thought that'd be fun. Yeah. Will's got my back. Because if they don't honk, 
They are no goose of mine. Let's move over to Game Cam. Game Cam. Game Cam. Uh, would you would you like me to begin? I'll would start. you you want to start? Okay. Mallory, take us on this magical journey. I also just love the the design, the layout of everything. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. Just the sweet little good sounds. Press Y to honk. Are those bit alerts? <laughs> Stop! I'll never be able to read them all. Stop! Look at all those bells. Get them bells. Was this Animal Crossing? I'm going to pay attention to the controls to make sure I learn them also. Honk, run, crouch, beak. This is mine. Three hour game takes eight hours. <gasps> Mallory plays with all of the bells. So you have to bend down to pick things up off the ground, but you can get them off the ground. Oh, you look, uh, you got a dirty tennis ball. Yay. You're a dog. You're basically a dog now. Oh. Got it. Oh. Broke it's it. not really what I expected to happen there. Fall off the hinges. Look at you. The beautiful bird. It's a good place to bring in the uh the title card. So uh if you missed the very, very beginning of the stream, um we are at least semi-familiar with this. We're, I'm still calling this a blind playthrough because Mal and I have actually technically never played this game. Whee! And we've seen this first area before. Yeah. And I think that's it. Um, we watched Dan play it. So we're going to be... It's going to be a little new to us because we've never actually played it. And then after we get past the first area, I believe at that point, everything feels new. So it'll be exciting. All right, here's my tasks. Get into the garden, get the groundskeeper wet, steal the groundskeeper's keys, make the groundskeeper wear a sun hat, rake in the lake, have a picnic. And I do believe that there are um, some, like, hidden objectives as well. I got him wet. So our plan was to just trade off every task, and I think that that's probably a good plan. So how did you check your Why list? Why is the most important button? <laughs> Seems so. Okay, so it's this... Minus. Those are the controls, uh -huh. in case you forget them. Get into the garden. You did it. Thanks. I feel accomplished. Bear Link gifted a sub to House House. Putting House House of the Month. Thank you, Bear Link. We got seven months in a row from Twitching Bug 23 Honk like you've never honked before. To honk fin of the end beyond. I honked. So, so much honking. Uh, we've got a four month resub from uh, B. Let's see. Uh, Boff Banoff. I got there. Four good honk. You thought three good was enough. No, four good now. No, stop trapping me. Reed the Nintendo Painter gives a sub to Rake in the Lake. Thank you, Reed. I got your keys. Oh, they are stuck here now. What are you going to do? Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> Make the groundskeeper wear a sun hat. Rake in the lake. Have a picnic. Rake in the lake seems easy enough. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out what I should do with these keys. You could leave them here, and then he'll come get them. Can I, can I just drop them here? He'll never get them. Yeah. They're in the hedge. What's he going to do? He's just going to be worrying about that forever. 
I can do rake in the lake. Yeah. How do I grab L. this? You gotta duck down and A is grab. Oh, got it. Thank you. Hmm. Where is he? He's after his keys. Oh God. Tactic tactical He's espionage so upset action. about his keys. Rake I'm, in the lake. I think I broke the game by putting them in the <laughs> in the hedge. Anyway. Take that, Gardener. Like I said a minute ago, we are at least vaguely familiar with uh, how to accomplish these goals. So we'll probably be getting into the second area um, a little bit faster than first-time players. Hotex Page gifted a sub to Goose. Thank you, Hotex. Got a 13-month in a row sub from Sapphire Becca. I think this is my first resub at night. I don't blame you for the holiday confusion, Stephen. All that dead toad fan art yesterday probably gave off a spooky Halloween vibe. <laughs> yeah, if anyone hasn't seen that, uh, Sapphire Becca did art, and then also um, Jared Dillon did art that I saw of uh, dead toad. Just uh, search uh, Twitter for hashtag Morning Mario and check it out. I know that probably sounds weird and be like, "Hey, you want to see? You want to see dead toad? You want to see him?" He died of the chilies. Everything I just said is real. You don't even know. There was a Morning Mario episode I just played, yeah. and it's it's called to like Toad goes to a Chili's, an ASMR experience. <laughs> and I'm just like, what? And and the level was not particularly memorable. I think it got upvoted by uh -huh. the community because the title was ridiculous. So people were like, what the heck? And like I'll admit. It's pretty good title. Oops. That was a mistake. It's a pretty good title. Sandwich. Sandwich. 300 bits from Murmur says, this is my rake now. He's still upset about his keys. Thank you, Murmur. Honestly, that might have been like the the pro strat right there is to just throw him right there into the hedge so he couldn't what? get to them. What? Where's your sandwich? You can just take all of his stuff. I know. You got two months sub from... What uh, else was on this list? I keep forgetting. A Beth Lauren. Two months. It's just it's just uh, gone 1 a.m. in England, so I'll be here as long as I can stay awake. Well, thank you for joining us. And uh, game is about three to four hours long. But uh, this will be going up on YouTube at some point in the near future. Oh, you can turn quickly if you let go of Run. Oh. Yeah. Or are you going to try to assemble the picnic? That's what I'm working on. Okay. Yeah. Definitely requires some stealth. It's exciting. Is a carrot on the list? Do do do. I got a carrot. I don't know if carrot is a carrot a part of a picnic. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Pumpkin thermos sandwich radio basket. It's kind of a weird picnic, but I, I, I guess I shouldn't judge. People are allowed to have whatever picnic they'd like. Uh, pumpkin's out of the. Is he finally? Is he finally over the keys? Did he realize that he'll never see them again? Maybe. That, that that's over now. Thermos. Thermos. Don't forget, you can hold uh, R, to zoom out if you need to. Oh, that R. No, you don't... Do, 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 <laughs> This game has had such an interesting um, development history. Especially because, like, whenever they first announced it, it's so cute. And it was eye-catching, even from when we first saw the earliest screenshots of it. And I'm, I'm so happy that the game basically stuck to what it was at that time too. Let's get this pumpkin. And some of the uh some of the best indie experiences are just these little short and sweet uh funny adventures. Also, also the, this pumpkin. Also the sound design in this game is really good too. Yeah it is. King Curon says my favorite part of the game is the unnecessary wing flapping that you can do. Sandwich radio basket. 
sandwich radio basket. And Ghost Kid points out that uh, you can change camera zoom to toggle instead of hold, if you'd like. I saw that in the settings. Just, you can actually change... Um, you can basically change anything, because they're, uh, they're all default set to hold, and you can change it to toggle. So you can change, I guess, like crouch and... Um, like holding things with your beak, you can change all of that. I don't remember if Apple was on the list, but th why not? Giggletail says, it's one of my favorite YouTube channels, but the developers of this game are very unprofessional in a good way. That's a good way of putting it. Hi, sweetheart. Can you toggle honk? <laughs> no. <laughs> Hi. Oh, I would I would say sorry. probably not. Untitled Kepi Game. Oh. Hey, buddy. Oh, sweetheart. You're going to roll boy. right off the end of my leg. Grab the basket. When you go slowly, like, uh -huh. in a circle while crouched, it does look like you're, like, a secret agent goose. Secret agent goose! What's left? Radio? Radio. Uh, is that, seriously, that's the last one? You yeah. already got them all? Yeah. Well, that was pretty fast. You gotta do the sun hat yet. Okay. Yeah, the uh, the radio is actually definitely one you're you should save for last anyway, because it makes noise. Run, 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 run. Did it? Did you get it? I did it. Oh, Haley's here. Hi, Haley. Hi. Hope you had a you? hope you had a good Thanksgiving and welcome to Honksgiving. Where are you? Instead what? of giving thanks, we give honks. There you are. Hi. <laughs> and Look, read, come see my picnic. And Reed, the Nintendo Painter, gives a sub to uh, Haley, the Kublius, putting her at five months. Thank you, Reed. Come see my picnic. Jam you know sends uh, 300 bits and says, Now, radio in the lake, like Firewatch. <laughs> oh, he's so mad. Toss it in the lake, quick! No, no! Give me that back! I stole that fair and square! Can you get it from him? No, he has to go set it down. You weren't fast enough. <laughs> no, don't put it in there! Did you finish that objective? I did, I was gonna go radio in the lake though. Now it is my turn to radio in the lake. Hi, Kippy. I scared him. <laughs> He's faster than you. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh, he's like my rank. Wait, this is my rake! <laughs> He's very unhappy about everything that has transpired. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, uh, so let's... Take a look here. Um, so you did all those. Yep, you gotta do the sun hat. And make the groundskeeper hammer his... Thumb. Thumb. We bought those rocks so we haven't... Yeah. Life! Uh, make the groundskeeper wear a sun hat. Okay. Um, let's see, I have to... I have to steal his current hat, which means he has to be... He has to go back to gardening. Yeah. But in the meantime, I'm just going to take a little look around here. See what's going on. I think... Let's see, how do I... L. LR or LZ or whatever. Excuse me, sir. If you want this to grow, you need to water it. There we go. <laughs> I helped. I helped. Look, I helped. Where you, what are you... Oh, t leave that alone. <laughs> He's like, what are you doing? I'm just trying to make you the flowers grow. rainwater. Sorry. 
Oh. Oh, it's gone. Ah, 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 ah. What you doing there? What you doing there? <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Oh, or are you gonna take it that he can't get it? He can not follow you in the lake. But would he want to? I mean, he went after the radio. Oh no! <laughs> do 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 do. <laughs> this hat is mine. <laughs> You're taking it all the way back. Where are you gonna go? You gonna come all the way after me? And I don't think you are. I highly doubt that you will. How do I you had duck. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Crap. Duck down. I have to re-grab the thing. Where'd it go? It's the question mark. Duck down. But it has to have the... the Duck your head down. Oh, before I can pick it up. That's what you mean. I was like, but I don't see the marks. Oh, so he can't... Here, it goes here. Celebratory honk. <laughs> I got it. I didn't even get to see him put he it on. He gave up and went and did oh, it. Oh yeah, he gave up on that. Okay. Technically, you're 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 back. Hi, sweetheart, <laughs> can't be. <laughs> Why do you duck? Shouldn't you goose? Got to duck the goose. Five on three sub from JD three D. Does a goose at breakfast go crunk? I liked it. I liked it. Thank you, JD. <laughs> 13 months from Dark Sky Destiny. Thank you for that. Uh, 12 months. A year. For Lissa Little Bear. Thank you, Lissa. Oh, look, a sun hat. Congratulations. He's after his pumpkin. And uh, 300 bits from Wolves of Pie. Cheer, cheer, cheer. Honk, honk, honk. <laughs> Make the drawing researcher. Honk. You're trying to uproot all of the... Yeah, I did it. This poor gardener. I feel... I feel bad. Not that bad. But, like, a little bad. Like, on a scale from one to ten. Like a... Like a three. Like a three. Three bad. It's the opposite three of... Bad. Opposite of three good. Tra Instead of trace... Trace BN. It, trace... Trace Mal. Yeah. Three bad. You're really trying. Come on. You're really trying. You really want this to work. I do. <laughs> Can't guarantee it's going to... Oh, well, it looks pretty good. Nope. I don't even know if you can do this. I mean, like, I understand... Yeah, I don't think they're, su I don't think they're supposed to interact. It seems to be going through it. I think they're just objects. Uh, I'm sorry that you had to find out this way. Save the water. <laughs> you take his cooler too? Yeah. Oh, oh, maybe you, <laughs> maybe you can fill up the cup with water. Ah, good idea. That's how I water plants: is just throw them on the ground and pour water on. It works out really well. <laughs> oh, it's upside down. <laughs> Jade says the watering can has a leak. Not a very good watering can. If you get in too far into the specifics, it feels like the the reservoir of water just is unlimited because you could probably just run that water forever. <gasps> Filled up your cup. Are you thirsty? I helped. <laughs> no. He can't even. He's like, well, everything's here. My shoe. You put your cup Why back. Why did you do that? <laughs> Why does this look like my morning routine at work? <laughs> what is your job? <laughs> All right, just clocked in and uh, got to take this small coffee cup and fill it up outside under the hose. And then I need to steal my coworker's shoes and uproot all the signs around the office. 
That'll probably take me to lunch. <laughs> Do you hunt geese for a living? <laughs> that yeah, that would be the a real. The sign is so mean. <laughs> that sign can't stop me because I can't read. <laughs> Look, I got your sign. Ah. Uh. <laughs> What's he going to do next? He's going to put his sign back. Do you hunt He's geese? He's going to pick up the hammer. Or do geese hunt like you? Like this. Way too early. I know. What? What? You did it! And he's dead. <laughs> Homicide count? One! Oh, wait, no, he's fine. <laughs> Surprised he hasn't come after me. He's sorry, after the Sorry thermos. about your stuff. Uh, okay. So that's all these things. Now, did you want this? No. Did you need this? <laughs> <laughs> he's always so surprised he stepped in water. You live outside of a lake. I feel like you would be aware of what's going on. All right. Just want to see what's over here. The keys are still. Yep. Oh yeah, we can um we can lock him out of the garden. <laughs> Is that how we do it? Because he doesn't have his keys anymore. You did it. <laughs> I am your god now. <laughs> <laughs> Secret objective. What's he doing? He wants the shovel. Oh, I don't like this. <laughs> I thought I thought he was gonna like jump the fence and beat me. You could get me wet. Nah. Okay. All right. I technically did an objective, yeah. so I'll, I'll give it back to you. <laughs> I'll bury you, goose. Uh, we can move on to the next section. The next yeah. the next section is the section that uh, Dan stopped playing in. We've seen a little bit of it. There's a few a few little things I remember. You gonna give that that rose to someone? Is that a rose? I'm gonna go find a cute goose. <laughs> I think it's a tulip. Yeah, might be a tulip. <laughs> Everyone quoting, "You could get me wet." Look, I brought you a tulip. Splash. You want this? Take this. I, uh, I only like planes. Don't you? But look. I only like planes. You're not a plane. Get away from me. Wow. That poor child. Ba -ba -ba! Luke a lot with a thousand bits. I think we can all agree the goose is objectively the villain of this game. I mean, yes, yes, there is no one else causing madness or trouble. It is the goose. Um, the goose is the protagonist, but the protagonist can also be a villain. We're playing a villain. Goose is villain. Luke a lot, thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. Villain protagonist. Haley says, This is the only game that lets me terrorize children. And that's pretty rad. <laughs> Mallory and Haley, same wavelength. Get in there and don't you don't you come out. <laughs> 
Please help me. There's a crazed animal. Oh, I beat the objective. <laughs> Alex didn't get past the farmer, though, filthy casual. Is there anything you can do in there? Uh, maybe. You've alerted him, though. I'm trying to run back in. I'm like, nah. <laughs> You're on the security system. I did an objective. I ran in there and there was a little button. <laughs> what? Oh my goodness. Leave me alone. Bottle, bottle honk. I'm just, I'm just trying to recycle. <laughs> no, I'm recycling. Fine. Can you actually recycle? Go. Is there a bin you can place that in? It's a very aggressive shop owner. Muffled honk. What a break the broom. Make the boy wear the wrong glasses. Make someone buy back their own stuff. Go shopping. Okay. Hello, Kepi. Was Get on TV a normal objective or a secret objective? Uh, I think it was normal. Okay, I wasn't sure. <laughs> His little head went... Mm. <laughs> Just looking. Normal one, okay. Oh, what? I'm leaving! Now you're getting attacked. Big yikes. I got your plane. Hey, no! That's my plane! The kid's also afraid of you, but apparently he gets over his he fear the minute you take the plane. <laughs> oh yeah, ball! I love ball! Ball! Oh God! <laughs> Christ in a handbasket! Where's my inhaler? Hmm. Snowfox says there technically aren't secret objectives. They do appear on a list later. They're just harder. I see. No, I wanted your broom. Where is your broom? 200 bits from Twitching Bug 23. Thank you, Twitching Bug. I hope you are enjoying. Honksgiving. It's Honksgiving, and we will honk if we want to. Where am I playing, though? Where is it? <laughs> no, wait, I need those. <laughs> oh, boy. Give them here. Oh, she's faster than you. She's f oh no! She reached out and touched your goosey neck. Where is your broom now? <laughs> Scrape. Scrape. She didn't care about the basket. Also, IRL, uh -huh. if someone was doing this, I would I would peace out so hard, so fast. The sound of someone dragging a metal basket across asphalt. Oh my god. I would just be like, nope, can't, nope, bye. And then, uh, mm -mm, cannot deal with that sound. Can I? Not a good sound. Uh... 300 bits from Hotex Page. Hope you are having a honking good time. Uh... Thank you, Hotex. Was toothbrush something? Toothbrush. <laughs> by someone or by a goose? I mean, either. It, it's the sound. <laughs> all yeah. things, all, all, all of them are bad, but this, it's the sound specifically. Hmm. Cleaner. Is that cleaner? That might be cleaner. No, go in the basket. Go in the basket. If 
someone enjoys that sound, they need to return to whatever hellish portal they came from. There we go. I'm the I'm the person that has a very uh, very very visceral reaction to nails on a chalkboard. Like yeah. Even I can't even think about it too much because I mm, whoa whew, I can't do it. Item planted. Returning to base. <laughs> oh, I put it back in. You can recycle. Recycle. <laughs> Snowfox also with a tip. Uh, if you're trying to put stuff in the basket, you can try crouching next to the oh, basket, yeah. too. I like how the kid is is concerned about the walkie-talkie, but you're literally in front of him doing it. It's not, it's not like a, a trick. It's not like a party trick. Like, where's the sound coming from? It's, that's the walkie-talkie. No, I want to break your room. I'm three feet away. <laughs> Goodness. Kepler. Oh, Kepler. Yeah, chalkboards. Chalkboards are scary. Do not like. <laughs> what? <laughs> what, uh, what objective are you going for? I don't know. I'm just playing around with stuff. Oh, okay. Because it's uh, Break the Broom. I thought I might try that, but she keeps picking it up. He's looking for his plane. His plane is in the shop. And what is his... <laughs> what's the objective related to the plane? Um, it's... Make someone buy back their own stuff. Oh, oh so he's gonna go look for his plane. Maybe. Oh. I guess that would work. I mean, that makes sense to me. It seems right. <laughs> Kepler's like, why does the goose get attention? I want attention. I broke the broom! The broom is destroyed. Ha ha. Society is crumbling. <laughs> All right. All right. So my objectives are make the boy wear the wrong glasses, make someone buy back their own stuff. And we haven't finished the go shopping thing. Yeah. Uh, go shopping seems hard. Um, well, the picnic wasn't too bad. Kepler, uh, you're just falling loo off me. Loo paper. Oh, sweet. Is this loo paper? Loo paper. Where are you going, <gasps> That kind of fits. Is it on the objective marked? Loo paper. Check the objective. What? Oh, you know, just like normal things that <laughs> normal I do. Normal goose things? I just, you know, moonwalk up through the world. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> now the cleaner's no longer... Oh, <gasps> God, no! Your cleaner! No! Don't look... Okay, she went away. Oh no, the small curb! Get it? There we go. I'm gonna hide this behind this uh, uh -huh. hedge. Alright. Now. We got the loo paper, but we did lose out... The cleaner. Uh... Oh, we moved to the wrong one. There we go. Um, yeah, we moved... Okay. So I definitely need... Oh god, she's gonna go look for it. Don't do that, though. What if you just didn't? What if you didn't? Where are you going? Don't go over there. There's nothing over there. Yeah, that's right. Huh? Huh? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Give me this! You gonna break it again? Oh, yeah. This is a huge distraction for her. Now it's in the water. 
Go get it. Please leave me alone. She'll probably start with that, and then she'll go get her other stuff. So let's Hopefully. grab a thing. Uh, fruit and veg. Fruit and veg. What is this? Uh, oh, God! Ah! <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't... Also, now she just has a weapon. <laughs> a stick. There's a hairbrush. She's gonna go... Alright. Wait, wait. Oh, I see it. Yeah. Uh-oh. Does she see you? I don't think so, but she's she doesn't know where this thing is, which is not ideal. Maybe I can kind of lead her over to where it is. Oh, this is hmm. I think I, I I think I actually messed up by taking the broom so far away. Sorry, this is a mistake. I wanted you to go get it and you didn't. So, could you do that? <laughs> ah, demon! Goose coming through. Beep 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 beep. Okay, ma'am. Ma'am? Ma'am? Oh, God. She's not here. Oh, God. She didn't find it? I don't know. Does she have anything in her hands? You have anything? Ma'am? What's she mm. looking for? What is her that? Her price gun. Oh. Okay. If I could just get you to come over here. I want, I want you to see something. Oh, wait. Hold on. I could take the other part of her broom, too. Oh, okay, she realizes she realizes what's going on. Alright, so let's very quickly Go for it! Uh oh. No, no, no! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! She got distracted. Ha ha! Fool! Put this in the basket. Put this in the basket. There. Got it. Tinned food cleaner and fruit and veg. I don't know where she is. Things are getting dicey around here. All right. Uh, that's a tomato. Yeah. So that's both. <laughs> <laughs> so that'll cover me for both, right? I mean, put it in the basket. Yeah. Oh, man. We get to see what the game qualifies a tomato as. I can't wait. Survey says... Fruit, fruit and, and veg. veg. Wow. It's both. Um, you did lose... I did lose... Something, but it's still counting it as in it. No, it felt, yeah. It fell further in, maybe? I don't know. I need uh, tinned food. Oh, she wants the hairbrush. Now she wants the broom. Come get it. Come get your broom. Come get your broom. Come get your nasty broom. What's this? Huh? What's this? It's one of those uh, 3D. I'm going to destroy everything. You'll rue the day. <laughs> Let's make a big mess. Okay. Now, what I need... What is it? Canned... Canned food. Canned food it's and... It's on that shelf. And uh, cleaner. And cleaner. Pff, I ran right nope. into her. Here we go. You want this? Do you want this? Here it is. There it is. Go get it. Go get it, Linda. You gonna impale a goose in front of a child? <laughs> Come on. Come here, Kippy. Also, at some point, you're gonna... Okay. okay. She's getting her broom. Yeah, she's very upset about this. She's gotta fix this. She sees oh, you. Listen, go fix your... Go fix your broom! She doesn't want you in her shop. I don't want her in her shop. Go fix your broom! Also, d does she really keep that good of a track on how many tomatoes she has? Kepler, maybe you shouldn't... Oh, he can't get in there, Matt. You have to stop him. Come on, honey. <sighs> Come here. He kept trying to get into my chair. He's not allowed in my chair. Not anymore. Not since I have the, the mesh chair. Did He's just going to lay on the carpet. Okay. He can do that, but he cannot get in that chair. Just tin. Tin food. Okay. I've been doing pretty good here. Just have to very carefully... Where is she? There she is. I'm trying to 
take it from her. Is that ten? Looks like ten. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's kind of a race here at this point. Yeah! yeah! Woo! <laughs> Woo! I did it! Here's all your stuff. I don't care. <laughs> It's like, if I can get this in the basket before you reach me, it's not going to matter. Ten months up from JavGamer99. Hey, Stephen Amal. How was your guys' Thanksgiving? It was good. It was really good. We, uh... It was very laid back. Hmm. The night before, we were up pretty late because Mal was making pies, one of which was on video. <laughs> That'll be out on Mal Makes, or should I say Mal Bakes. Yeah. Next month. Um... But we were up, up making pies, uh, so we got to bed late, didn't get a whole lot of sleep. But then we went and had Thanksgiving. It was fun, it was just, by the time you eat that heavy of a meal... Yeah. ...already on not a whole lot of sleep, by the end of the evening, like, when we went to bed last night, we just crashed. I mean, we were just like... But it was nice. It was good Thanksgiving. We enjoyed it. Uh, we also got a sub from Snowfox. Snowfox102. Thank you, Snowfox. Thank you for the tips, too. Look, I got your airplane. No. So you're trying to get the kid to rebuy his airplane? Yeah, I stole it back out of the shop. <laughs> you're going both ways with this thing. You're not sure exactly... Maybe give it to her? You know what I mean? Hmm. Like, do you think if she picked it up Maybe. and was like, oh, this is mine? I'm not entirely sure. We can figure it out. We'll keep trying some things, and if we can't if we can't figure it out, we can always ask the audience. Haley says, I played Spyro all day for Thanksgiving, like God intended. I remember that commandment. It was oddly specific. I'm in your shop! She might be trying to, like, go back and get... Yeah, I think if maybe if she sees you drop it while, she's, while you're both in the shop, then mm -hmm. she might address it. But it's hard to say for sure. That commandment took years to find. It was on the first draft that Moses broke, but it went missing from draft two. I get that reference. <laughs> Thou shalt play Spyro all of Thanksgiving. For thousands of years, people were puzzled by the commandment, but it all became clear in 1998. <laughs> She put the... Okay, so she put that on the thing. I get that reference to the Bible. No, it's a, no, it's a, the, the first draft that Moses broke. Breaking the Ten Commandments. It's a reference to uh, the Monty Python film. Oh, yeah. He's holding up the... He's, uh, he's on the, the, the mountain and he says, I bring you God's 15. And then he drops one of the stone Ten. tablets and he goes... Yeah. Oh, he picked up the Ten plane. Ten commandments. He picked up the plane from That's her. Good. Wait, where did you where did you have the plane? I had dropped it, and she put it on a shelf, and he came in and picked it up, and now she's going by him, and they're talking about the plane. Oh, I think, yeah, I think you did it. You don't understand. The goose... No, this is mine. I've always had this. You can't come in here and steal. Give me all your money. You did it. Good work, Mal. Your turn. A new to-do list item. Uh, trap the shopkeeper in the garage. But you can also, also make, him make the glasses. boy wear the wrong mm -hmm. glasses. Okay. Um, so first, the first thing we have to do is remove his glasses. So, where was the other... 
glasses in the shop. There's like a glasses rack. Okay, I'm trying to think. What would? What's the easiest way to make him bend down? And actually, probably, probably his toy. This is this is the same principle as the um, the hat. Yeah. Maybe. He was quick. Yeah, he is quick. I'm, I'm not sure if that's exactly how to do it. Actually, you can interact with. <gasps> Take his glasses. <laughs> and store those there. <laughs> And go get him a new pair. Ooh, the red one. Ooh, the sunglasses. Or those. I'm just grabbing the first thing I can. <laughs> you That's did That's gonna it. make life very difficult. It's gonna make life very difficult. Now she's like, where are my... Where's his glasses? Hairbrush. That kid keeps trying to steal everything. Uh -huh. Everything. Oh, look, she drew a no-duck picture. Rude. Also, you're a goose. Should be like a no goose picture. Um, draw. <laughs> I'm draw. I'm draw too. I wanted to draw a picture. I'll just Let's ruin dissolve. this chalk. That kid should probably probably like running into things a little bit fine i'm sorry i'm sorry i just it Unless... was the fastest route so now your objective is to trap the shopkeeper mm -hmm. in the garage purple boy says i wonder when the police get involved i hope they do i hope that that's that's okay. part of it Be exciting. I got your carrot. <laughs> it's in the crotch. Go get it. <laughs> <laughs> You're treating Why? her like she's a rabbit. It's in, it's in there. You're trying to catch a rabbit. It's it's in here. I put the carrot in the crotch. I got a leak. I'm making you a salad. <laughs> On the floor of a garage. Yeah. Okay, sure. Could rain. Could rain. In the garage. Oh, she is not happy about this. No, get in the garage. What? Gotta Open come up it. with a, gotta come up with a new plan. <laughs> Salad that consists of a single <laughs> carrot and a single leek. <laughs> the, tra the traditional salad making method. Oh, ooh, go get your leek. Go on. Do it. No, the one in the garage. It's She's getting the cleaner, probably for the salad. Because you gotta clean the garage floor before you assemble the salad. Um, it's, tra it's tradition. I think that's um. No. It's like some country that does that, probably. I got your broom. It's going in the garage. What are you gonna Along do? Along with all of it? your earthly possessions. <laughs> I think that your your the, your store should be in the garage. You're, you're literally just moving everything piece by piece in there, aren't you? This is, this is, this is preposterous. Look at all your carrots! The salad's really disproportionate, Mal. I'd... It's a carrot and apple salad with no apples. And a leek. And a leek. Hi, welcome to Friendly's. Can I interest you in a carrot and apple salad? It contains a ton of carrots... And ah, a leak. Ha, 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 you did it. No one can help you now. And I do believe this is our second homicide. Unfortunately, she starved to death in there. Three hundred oh, bits. A door. Three hundred. <laughs> oh, she's she's not actually trapped. 
300 bits from Gold Mage 162. Stephen, Moses breaking the first set of tablets when he saw the golden calf and having to go back up and get the second set is in the Bible. Oh. But also, it's a Monty Python movie. That's what I thought. Thank you, Gold Mage. She also says at least she had food, yeah? So I can I can just, like, keep Leave. going. Yeah. So we haven't seen anything past this at all. No. So this is good. This is all going to be completely new. I wonder what happens next. Left, Stephen. We're just seeing if it let me do it. How do I get in? Not that. Looks like the world really opened up too. Can't get in there either. Oh, well. Huh. Interesting. <laughs> it echoed? Hmm. Oh, this is back to the beginning. It is it? Mm-hmm. Gardner's on the left. What? See? Whoa! My mind just got blown. It's because the perspective changed. Yeah. Okay, can't interact with this. No. We can't, like, electrocute ourselves. That's good. That's good. Be a very different game. So there's a basket here. Neat. You had objectives? And we were just talking about Moses, in case we want to put them down the river. Uh, we don't have any new objectives yet. Well, you didn't enter the right area, then. I know. I'm still walking around. Oh, this is the back way into where we hid the keys. So, uh, yeah, everything is... Con Hi, bud. Oh, he can finally get back into his garden because you locked him out. Oh, my God. He's going to go the long way around? Maybe. Maybe he knows the keys are in there and he can't reach them. I still don't feel bad. I'm a honking mess. <laughs> All right, let's see where this goes, if anywhere. Nope, not there. Man, there's a good bit to this. It's exciting. All right. Um, do, 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 can't do, open do, that. Do, do, do. But there's a lot of things for me to steal in there. So let's head all the way back, and I guess we head this direction. Because I think this is the only way that we could go. Mm -hmm. I was going to say I can probably... Break those, yeah. Ta-da! Hello, sir. <laughs> I am here. I am Goose. You don't like Goose? Okay. Take a slipper. Take a slipper. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Can you fit through there? Nah, you can't. You have to open the gate. What are my objectives? Make someone break the fancy vase. Help the woman dress up the bust. Make the man spit out his tea. Get dressed up Aww. with a ribbon. Make the man go barefoot. I'm on that. Do the washing. Make the man go barefoot. Hi, Kip. So he cannot even conceivably get this over back. Here. Maybe. Sir, could you open this? Sir? I guess I could have opened this. Maybe. I don't know where he is. Okay, I'm he just going to... He doesn't gonna... need that back. No, he's never getting it back. Okay. In fact, can I drop this down the well? And goodbye. No, no, no. Goodbye. Goodbye. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Kepler. Maybe if I just like run. Now, put a put a thing in it. A pillow. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And he'll he'll leave it alone. Okay. <sighs> this may not be possible. Although, if I stick one here... I'm going to just stick that there, and then when I get the other one, I'll try and drop it in the same spot, and maybe I can get rid of it. Mm. So do you think that he just went back? You'll see, I guess. He's just okay with this? He's like, well... I've only got, you know... One slipper? I've only got one slipper, but I'm going to make the best of it. Yeah. 
Huh? Ooh, he's smart to you now. <laughs> you dropped your paper. How can I? I want to splash in this. Oh, there's someone else over there. Oh, no, no, I'm. I can't grab it. You might have to get it somehow, otherwise. Because he has his foot in it, yeah. like on the ground. I can't take the... I can't take the shoe. <gasps> it's not as easy as I thought it was gonna Maybe be. Maybe he switches his legs being crossed. After a time? Yeah, if you just wait and don't... Patience is a virtue. I don't know, he doesn't seem to be relaxing. Give him a second. I said, wait. I just wanted to see if I could do... Oh. Oh, God. You did it. <laughs> no, 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 no. Give that back. Give that back. <laughs> uh-uh. No. I <laughs> have a cricket ball. If you're not running, you can get through things easier. No! 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 Come here, bit! Ah! I took it through the fence <laughs> like magic! Sorry, it's very important for science, so let's see if I can get this down the well. You don't understand. <laughs> oh, man. When do we get a sword? <laughs> like a knife. <laughs> All right. Here we go. You did it. Sayonara, slipper! Huh. <laughs> Spin in a circle. Oh. You know what? This is almost better. <laughs> <laughs> I almost like the... <laughs> <laughs> Let's moonwalk up. I'm hoping that we can get another basket, get another way to, to do that. Three and a bits from Jam, who says, First thought, can we make someone fall in the wall? Can we make someone fall in the wall? I'm back. You want to play some cricket? Can you pull that man through the... I guess the goose is not super strong. Not super, super strong. Champ says, I meant well. That makes more sense. I thought you meant, can we make someone fall, like, through the fence? Look at me, I'm classy. I got a pipe. I'm but fall sophisticated. In, fall, fall in the well makes more sense. And maybe, although it seems like with how the characters your are. your hat. You want to put it on? It seems like they're very much regulated to certain areas. I'm not sure that they would follow us that far. Also, I don't know what the situation would be that we would actually get them to go into the well. But we got one of his slippers there, and I'm I'm going to I'm going to take that as a victory. We also have 8 months from Sudabite. Thank you, Sudabite. Almost a triple plus. <laughs> I can't I'm going to I'm going to read this. It's going to be bad, but I'm going to read it. It's the famous um painting of the pipe. Oh, Magritte? This is not a yeah. pipe. Yeah. Ceci n'est pas un pipe. Un pipe, by the way, is uh my favorite French phrase. Un pipe. I can recognize No, put it on me. I the want title. the book. I, and I I know the I know I the art piece. It. 
You want up here, bud? Come up here. Good boy. So what's your... Uh, I took your paintbrush. Brandon says, that was pretty okay, all things considered. <laughs> Thanks. Learning, uh, learning French slowly through trial and error. Doing my best. So, what is the... Oh, oh, that poor man. Drink your tea now. What is your current objective that you're after? I don't know. I'm playing around. You're just dragging stuff all over. Yeah. Bye. Oh, there's a cute goose. I know. You had a bow on. And you took it away? I did. It's gone. I was trying to get a cute bow. And now it's gone? See, she has it. I thought maybe she'd uh, yeah, she might. put it on me instead. So you're going to try and, like, remove the statue and stand where it was? I can't move the statue. Oh. Uh. Oh, boy, she has a weapon. Certainly she wouldn't kill you. Certainly not. We need a sub from Seraphim2000. Thank you, Seraphim. She's doing a wonderful job. Is she actually is she doing a goose? Is that what that's supposed to ultimately be? Put it on me, please. No me. I want it. Is that an objective or you're just trying to do that? Um Get dressed up with a ribbon. No, that is an objective. I don't know how you would do that exactly. Hmm. So many more toys to play with in this area. Yep. Wait, what looks like a squirrel? Everyone's saying it's a squirrel. Oh, the hedge is a squirrel. Oh. I just assume it's a goose. <laughs> Everything is a goose. Oh, yeah, okay. The part that's the front, I thought was, like, the back. But now I see it. But before, I was like, no, what are you talking about? <laughs> that's not, that's not a squirrel. But it is clearly a squirrel. <laughs> he had his tea for a second. Is that one of the objectives? Yeah. So while he's drinking the tea... Mm-hmm. You have to scare him. Ring the bell. Uh huh. And the lady whose garden you're in doesn't seem to mind. No. Nope. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, this man's very. All right, he's gonna pick up his tea. Like very freaked out about all this. Did it. Good work, Mal. Oh. Hey, why do you own a giant bell? Can you spin that? Grab it. Oh. Yeah, they're going to have a, uh, a problem. Make someone break the fancy vase. Help the woman dress up the bust. Get dressed up with a ribbon. Do the washing. Um... Yeah, you can move this. Oh, okay. She got it from you. Darn it. Honk at her, honk at her. I thought if you could get her to pay attention to the ribbon, you could go run and sit. Yeah. But yeah, this is a good idea. Is Basically, I'll... I need to wait for her to be preoccupied, but this will totally work. Um, I could... Actually, this is... If he gets more tea... Does he still have his, his thing? Yeah. Because that... They, they had, like, a little quarrel, and that was nice and time-consuming. So I'm thinking that's kind of be... That'll be what my plan is. Mm-hmm. 
Look at her. Just admiring, I guess, her neighbor's garden. <laughs> Drink your tea. Did he have to go get new tea? He no. spit out his tea. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> the plan has been set in motion. Just ignore me. You should have left the bow right there. Well... Where did I put the bow? It's against the fence. Is it over here? No, down. Oh, that, that? Oh. Just drop it there. Right, she's gonna see it, and then I'm gonna stand right here. She got distracted by the clippers you knocked over. Darn it. Go get the bow! What are you doing? Go get the bow! Yep, bow. Yeah. She's not going to notice the statue's missing. Because the statue... Is you. Is me. Mm -hmm. Very excited. <laughs> Give me your shoes. I'm beautiful now. You are beautiful. I'm beautiful now. Let me go hide and I'll hand this back over to you. Also, it looks like you might be able to go through the fence there, too. Uh huh. We're so precious. No, you can't. We're so precious. We are very precious. We're very precious. Oh, the stability of that was not good. Not very good. Oh, look, I can do oh, this. Oh, nice. Okay. You could probably, you might be able to open the gates too at this point. What? Oh, these gates. Yeah. Mm -hmm. for easy access in and out. I mean, they might be able to, like, close it, but... He's after my bow! He's trying to get your bow? Oh. I can't open it. You can't open it. Oh, okay. There's a ribbon. Wow. You are destroying these yards. Uh-huh. Completely destroying. Can't open that either. These things. So one of the objectives is destroying a vase. Is it that vase, probably? The thing she's probably painting? Yeah. You could throw that down the well. <laughs> if that doesn't count as destroyed, I don't know what does. Okay, so I can't do that from this side. But you can go in and out. Mm -hmm. There you have a little loop. You're just trying to mess up as, as much stuff as possible. Oh, she moved the stuff to the... Oh, uh, that's clever. Also, I... No, leave me alone. Yeah, he will take your, your ribbon. My ribbon. I wouldn't live next to someone that had a giant bell. I just wouldn't do it. That would be crazy. This is a big old gong. You're going, you are going to embarrass a lot of people. There. Pair of socks, slipper, and a bar of soap. A slipper! Oh! Whoops. I left one. Yeah. I left one. I precariously balanced it. It's fine. It's fine. 
<laughs> S for slipper. <clears throat> yeah, it's fine. Just go, you know, just go get it where I left it. But yeah, you probably should get that sooner rather than later. And I'll keep that in mind. Maybe I shouldn't, like, you know, just Toss chuck, things down chuck the well. everything down the well. You know. The uh, honk alert is louder than my honk. That fell down on her. Why? Because I honked at the right time? <laughs> Gold Mage says, Don't ding the bell! You can't ring the bell until after you recover Dad's wooden gong, fight the charcoal man twice, and get two legendary swords. Do you get that reference? Mm-hmm. It's been it's been a while. Slipper, slipper, slipper. It's been a while, Tulip. Thank you, Gold Mage. The most frustrating Tulip part. I got the slipper back. <laughs> Nerdy Rebels, he says you got to do the voice. As I recall, it was like Toad, but getting the life squeezed out of him. Don't take the bell. Something like that. You can. Until after you recover Dad's wooden gong, find a charcoal man twice, then two legendary swords! That was loud. It also hurt. Soap, soap, soap. You're welcome. <laughs> One free flourish. Soap. Soap. How did I ever do that, uh... How did I ever do oh, that voice bubbles. more than, like, once? Because already I'm like, ooh, mistake. Julep is a, uh, it's a, it's a, it's a great movie. Look at the bubbles. It's a great movie. Can you honk with soap? I'm going to wait till I sneak by. I don't want him to take my ribbon. So he's going to pick up the paper and then I'm going to sneak by. Okay. Ha! You can make bubbles! You did the wash! I washed your things. Buenos sources. I didn't know Tulip was a movie. Sometimes I, there, I, I, I think that people should experience video games for themselves. And Tulip is one of those weird exceptions where I'm like, it's better to watch it. <laughs> it's really hard and frustrating to play. Uh, make someone break the fancy vase so we don't break it. Make someone break it, uh -huh. and then help the woman dress up the bust. Just gotta get in here. The bus. She does try and fix the uh, the gate, and if you honk at the right time, it falls down. See honk. Hello. 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 Hi. Hey, how's it going? You having a good Friday? You like doing this? Same thing forever? I am your god now. I can't get too close, though. Alright, um, so we have to... Oh, she's mad. So we have to dress this up. Uh-huh. Because this is the bust. Yeah. How would we do that? What hmm. would you dress this up with? His hat. Who? The guy's hat. His red hat, oh, if you take yeah, that, yeah, 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 maybe yeah, bring yeah, yeah. it in, maybe she'll do it. Okay. That's a good idea. I'm gonna go get it. So let's start by... And he wants my, um... Bow. bow which, I mean, honestly, he could have. Aww. So let's see here. Um... We can't undo things, so no. we can take this out now. I'm just going to drop this over here. Maybe he'll slip on it. Yeah, I have this. I was really hoping that'd work. Oh, shoot. He's after a slipper. Oh, darn it. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! 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 Fine. Fine. 
Equivalent exchange. Give me the hat. Darn it. How very upsetting. It's not even your soap! Why do you care? Here we go. Alright, he doesn't know. Alright, so can I open this with this in my mouth? No. I'm in. How did this happen? It's probably the goose that's been terrorizing you. Alright, here we go. This seems like a good move. Yeah, just drop it there. Maybe pull over the fish guy. Oh no, she sees it. He threw the bow over. Oh, she's probably going to throw the thing you over. You can go stand in the or spot. Or she'll just put... That's surprising! Oh, go get stand the... in the spot, yeah. Get the bow back. She looks mad about something. Is it me? You? Is it me? <laughs> what? What'd I do? What'd I do? Maybe you also have to get his glasses and pipe. Okay. That seems... That seems... These these are reasonable things. How does she not know that they belong to her neighbor? Don't know. Because he'll throw the bow over. The pipe doesn't... I don't know if the pipe makes sense. So you know it's gone? No. Go. Careful, 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 careful. There you Going. Go. I give this offering. <laughs> Ma'am. Please. Place it onto this statue. Please do it for me. Why would you do this? <laughs> Have you lost control of your life? We're getting somewhere uh -huh. with this, surprisingly. The pipe, I don't think, would stick in it. Yes, that... do the pipe. All right, I'll get the pipe. Ouch. Hey, Frank. How's it going? I'm back. What's it like being barefoot, Frank? It's pretty cold. Are we good? Oh, no. Oh, he sees the pipe. Go. He doesn't see the pipe. He just wants to know where it is. Shoot, shoot, shoot. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> Sucker! Sorry, fallen comrade. <laughs> oh, no, no, get get in the hole. Yeah. She sees it. Could you... I don't have thumbs. Could you do this for me, please? You did it! Oh, she found you. Looks just like Frank. Uh, make someone prune the prize rose, but then also make someone break the fancy vase. So if you want to try and go for that, uh, fancy vase. Hmm. So we have Linda and Frank. Yes. <laughs> These are their names. I don't, I don't name them. They're just, it's just the canonical names that I decided. <laughs> Bus needs a smoke. Well, he found one slipper. Again, everyone gets so confused when their feet touch water. And it's bewildering to me, because I'm like, you know that you're stepping in it. You can see the water coming. Where's he going with that slipper? Is he throwing it back? Yep. That's a nine month three sub from Frozen Kitsune. Relaxing honk stream to help take the edge off the day. Thank you, Frozen. Congrats on Triple Plus. And I hope that you and everyone else joining us this evening is relaxing. Relaxing. Also, it is Black Friday. Did mm -hmm. uh, did anyone did anyone go out into the into the wild west of retail today and buy stuff? Just curious if anyone uh if there was a if there was a deal that someone was like I'm going to I'm going to do it. Oh my god. Sing for your people. Sing the sorrows of a goose. 
Watch out because it's a goose. The goose has unfortunately been set loose. He is going to come. He's going to take your bra. Then he's going to find a saw. He's going to cut people into two. He might do that. You don't know. He's going to take your pipe and stuff. And he's going to throw your sneakers down a well. That didn't rhyme very good. But he will also send you straight to hell. As soon as he gets a weapon, you better be running. I rate my own performance a 5 out of 10. <laughs> It really caught me off guard because I was literally in the middle of thinking through like, oh, I'm talking about a thing that happened today. And it was like, no, you're not. You're singing about the sorrows. Also, is it sorrows of a goose? I just, I just basically sung about a homicidal goose. I'll take homicidal goose. Mr. Game Boy, thank you. They <laughs> often come at a very surprising time. <laughs> a very surprising time. Josh Grant's child said, needed more honks. Three out of ten. I'll give that. I'll give that to you. It, did, it, needed, it needed some more honks. Sorrows of a Goose's victims. Uh, let me let me rewind up here since I just asked that question, though. Uh, Leafly says, I went to Walmart for a TV. Never again. Fair. Audoodle says, I got uh, Impossible Lair for $10 at GameStop. That's pretty good. Impossible Lair. And that just came out. Impossible Air just came out. It was fun, too. And uh, it runs at 60 FPS on Switch. Handheld and docked. If you're looking for something that makes the pain of not having a new Donkey Kong Country go away, the closest thing you're going to get is ukulele in the, in the Impossible Air. Uh, scrolling up because I missed some of this. Nightclaw said, first time I've ever done it, and I hope to never have to do it again. <laughs> Explosive Joseph said, my brother got a gaming laptop. There's some really good deals on laptops this year. <laughs> Alright, I need to scroll back down. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get back, caught back up on the, on the, on the chat here. I left the house today and it was a bad idea. <laughs> a lot of people saying it was, it was a little rough. I, um, I actually, uh, I read, I read a, uh, is a, where did I read this? Maybe Discord? Maybe Twitter? I don't know. Someone just said they went to Best Buy, and they went really early. Like, really, really early. And it wasn't bad. And I was like, oh. It was like before people were there to, like, just doing their shopping. Maybe yeah. Best Buy didn't have super great deals, and people weren't worried about it. Like it wasn't their their priority thing because that's <clears throat> that's one of the big things about Black Friday is that if you're going to do if you're going to go for something and there's like two places you have to figure out which one you're going to go to early to try and get the deal like you can't be in two places at once so Faelina got the stream deck yep those were on sale too there was a lot of Elgato Elgato stuff that was on sale. Games in the computer monitor. Joy-Cons were marked down. Joy-Cons are so expensive. I mean, I get it. You're getting... <clears throat> you're essentially getting two controllers. But dang. I think I did it. I think I did it. Ghost Kid said, I was working at Target on Black Thursday. It wasn't nearly as bad <gasps> as I expected. Partly because it was raining, and also because apparently our Walmart took most of the chaos from us. Well, that's good. All right, let me scroll back down. Get caught back up here. Yeah, hey, I think the thing that bugs me most about the Joy Cons is that not only are they eighty dollars MSRP, but they break. It's so frustrating. So so frustrating. Because like. $80 for, like, a normal Nintendo product, right? Like, because Nintendo products generally stand the test of time. Better, I'd say, than any other company. Certainly a third-party company, but even, I'd say, probably better than, than Sony and Microsoft. And Joy-Cons is, like, the first time where I'm like, oh my god, this is not good. They just break. I destroyed the rose, so it's your turn. Oh, did you? Mm-hmm. Okay. You can, uh, if you want, you can, um, uh, you can read the alerts. 
Bear Link sent 300 and Steven, I'm bewildered that you're bewildered by the people being bewildered by their feet touching water. It just seems kind of weird that every time they touch, they're like, oh, what's happening? And it's like, well, it's water. It's like a concept I feel like most people are pretty familiar with. I brought so you, the vase over to So you to brought him. the vase mm-hmm. over. And he's currently mad at her for breaking the rose. So I thought maybe he might break the vase. On his own? In just retaliation? Like- I mean, that would be a pretty, like, disgruntled man. There it is, buddy. Do whatever it is you gotta do. Because he's been throwing everything back over. <gasps> See? Oh, it's your turn. <laughs> I was like, uh, look at this. And then that was it. And I was like, okay. But that's everything. That's everything. Now what? I don't know. Something must have opened. Maybe. <laughs> Aw, no goose. I'm already here. People don't like the goose. Anyway, Bear Link, thank you for the bits. Also, I had 100 bits from uh, Lixren. Thank you, Lixren. And 300 bits from Orion, uh, the Starhog. Says, I'll only do Cyber Monday. I'm not getting slugged or worse, slugging someone over something I could probably get online. Which is fair. There's a lot of people doing oh, Cyber Monday down. more I than see. ever. So now you, can, now you can exit. I could. Yeah, I, um... We, we used to, in uh, especially in the early vlogs, we used to go out for Black Friday not because we needed things, um, but because it was just a tradition. We would get a bunch of friends together and just go do some shopping. But we never got up like early to get the deals. It was just like, let's go see, let's peruse, see what we can find. Um, Basically, you'd look through, like, DVD sections that look like bombs went off, because there's just stuff everywhere. <laughs> but, um, we haven't done that in a few years. Now we just, you know, we might look online and be like, oh, there's a thing. And I actually ordered a, um, I ordered, uh, a hard drive. Technically last night. But it was a, it was a Black Friday deal. Yeah. I've been doing all the data she migration. She painted a no goose sign. Aww. Sad. I've been doing all the data migration, and I discovered that the stuff I was migrating wouldn't fit on the 8 terabyte I had, but it would fit on a 10, so I ordered a 10 terabyte drive. Fun. Very fun. 300 bits from Jam, who says, um, All I know is I went to a Walmart for some small necessary items three years ago, and it was 1 a.m. after Thanksgiving, with one cashier working, and I emerged from it three hours later, mostly dead inside. That is the entire scope of my Black Friday efforts. Wow. Wow. I saw a post recently... Um, I don't know where I'm going. I think on Twitter, and it said... With the current trends, Black Friday will begin on Halloween in 10 years. I was like, yeah, sounds right. It always bugged me whenever they started doing stuff on Thanksgiving. And it was just a few years ago, I think, that they really started doing that. And I remember when I found out, I was like, you don't, what? You don't do that. Look, I'm a baby. Baby goose. Little baby goose. Purple Boyo says, speaking of Black Friday, when's the promo code... Uh, for the new shop going to end. Uh, we're going to run that through Cyber Monday. So it'll, it'll, it'll end, like, middle of next week. Like, Tuesday or, or Wednesday. And if anyone hasn't seen that, Brandon's already got me, um, we relaunched the shirt store. We've kind of needed to do that for a long time. <laughs> so we have new designs in there. We have breakfast stream shirts. Uh, we have a 10-year commemorative shirt for the vlog. Um, we've re-released the Let's Meet Back Tomorrow mug. It's now printed on both sides. <laughs> the future is now. Um, and we also have toast stickers. Although I believe the toast stickers are only available to the U.S. Just because oh, this goes back the die-cut stickers aren't available uh, elsewhere. But if you're in the U.S., you can get toast stickers. Ooh, a boot. And we're, uh, we're going to try and be a little more uh, proactive about adding designs. So you can probably expect new designs being added a little bit more regularly than, uh, than before. I can. But yeah, if you, uh, if you order anything, you can use the code 10YEARS to get 10% off. And we're going to be running that through the weekend. Uh, 
We've got a four-month mm-hmm. sub from uh, Akira who says, Honk! I am glad, glad to see you playing this. My daughter seems to be interested in watching the goose. Well, as much as a three-year-old can be. Or a three-month-old can be. Thank you, Akira. And I hope she enjoys... Honksgiving. There's so much honking. Where are you now? Hi, in another I wasn't, area. I wasn't watching how you got here, so I, whenever it's my turn, I'll be lost again. Failing to ask, uh, is there plans to re-release old shirts? Um, maybe. Maybe. If there's if there's a particular outcry for like certain cert- shirt designs to return, then we we'll either bring them back or we'll like um, we'll do updated versions of them. But as of right now, our plan is to just make new designs and put designs in the store that haven't been seen before. But. Any plans for uh, Peggy merch? Yeah. Yeah, we have some ideas. All right, let's see. We do, we do, have, we do have some ideas for that. Hi. <laughs> it's just like the game. No, I want in. Hmm. You trying to drive a car? Maybe. You can't drive a car, you're a goose. I'm sorry that you had to find out this way. Hmm. A Roland's box truck. <laughs> yeah, we're uh we're we're definitely aware that the the new store has a smaller number of items than the previous store. It's just that Technically, every item in the new store is new. Um, none of them have been seen before. So it's like a bunch at once, but we're going to start releasing new stuff. But yeah, we'll definitely... Uh, um, take into consideration using some of the old designs as inspiration for like updated versions. Uh, and Kay Saunders, uh, stevenshop.com. Asking where to order shirts. And Brandon has been posting links every once in a bit. But stevenshop.com will take you there. And actually, since I'm just a- I'm just advertising merch now, um, Mal actually, there's a sale running today, isn't there? Yes. So if you check out Mal's link, um, it's CyberDeals is the code? Uh, yeah, I think so. CyberDeals is the code. And Mal doesn't get to set her codes or anything. That's That comes down from Redbubble. But uh, there's twenty, f- there's pretty deep discounts from Redbubble. It's like twenty-five to forty percent off on mouse stuff. So if you're interested in getting like a print or a poster or a phone case or something from Mouse, um, check that out because that's mm-hmm. going on to de- or until December second, I think, is the range on that. Again, we don't get to set those deals. Redbubble decides those. So we're just like, whatever they say. I don't know what to do. Yeah, there's some good stuff. Did you check your list? Yeah, I did. Was that you checking the list? Accidentally, yeah. Ooh. <laughs> I can get in the box. I'd say that's what you should do. Okay. You should wait. Just hide right here. Because they're unloading the truck, right? Yeah. Oh, no. I think you've become part of the box. What if you get in the box, and then while you're in the box, you honk? There you go. Now wait. Huh. Thought we got all the boxes in. Interesting. 
Come on, pick up my box. Oh, you're going for a ride. <laughs> Special delivery. <laughs> it's a haunted box. They're not too concerned that Ooh, the box... Oh, this area is big. <laughs> Everyone is very concerned. No one's willing to open the box. I'm surprised how big this area is. Wow. Hi. Hello, I am Goose. Ruiner of worlds. Anyway, you, um... Did it. Yeah. <laughs> I want to play a game. Oh. <laughs> I ended up in the box again? <laughs> yeah, I... You gotta remember, last time I got the controller, the vase was already on the ground. Oh, and he yeah? grabbed it, and I was like, okay, it's... I want to play the game. I don't even know where you are. In a box. Leave. Ta-da! All right, now I will check the objectives. Break the dartboard, get the toy boat, make the old man fall on his bum, be awarded a flower. Steal a pint glass and drop it in the canal. Set the table. Okay. So, first off, where am I? Can't grab these. They're too heavy for goose. That's from the other side. Can't go that way. It looks like I could... Yeah, like if I could roll this... Can I grab... Ouch. No, I can't grab this. I was thinking maybe I could push this so I could jump over the fence and open it. And I could get back anytime I wanted. This you is can already get back anytime you want. I can? Yeah. Do you need your plate? Does it the table? Yes. Take the plate. Or don't. Still looking. Still looking. You do a lot of looking. I'm realizing I don't do enough looking. I want to I want to do a little extra looking. Like what's over here? Nothing. I can't see. So I guess nothing. All right, let me grab this. Oh, is this the table? I don't know. It might be. Set it there and see. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. It's like uh it's it's a lady in the trant yeah. reference, I guess. Knife, fork, pepper candle. Now, left of the hose. Oh, I understand, yeah. Well, if I get kicked out of this area, I don't know if I'll be able to get back. I don't know. What do you got? She's <laughs> going to take that back to the car. And that's how I can get back There's in. There's the pepper. There's something in the floorboards! Getting the pepper's going to be hard. Not impossible. Mm -hmm. Oh, the dartboard. Yeah, there's a dart. Well, I've already started on this. Mm -hmm. So now I'm like... They're probably not going to want me up here. Well, maybe not. Maybe they're fine. Sneaky. So much for to playing my game. It's Tom! It's Tom Fox. Raiding us. Raiding with a party of 237. Thank you, Tom. Hey, Tom. How was, uh, how was game? Bees churger. Bees churger. Oh. Honk. 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 Ow. Oh. So that's like cheeseburger, but like, the it was spelled bees in badly. Instead of cheese. I understand. Well, hi, Tom. Thank you for sending some folks over. Hi, everyone. We're playing Untitled Goose Game. It's a goose game, but it sadly was not named. Right now, we're trying to set a table. Oh, this woman's stuck. Oh no, bless her. She knows you're under there. She doesn't know anything. 
Mm. Look, now she thinks I'm over there. That fool. Look at that cork on that barrel. <gasps> I want it. Paul, you did it! Ah! Oh no, oh no, oh no! <laughs> anyway, this is what we've been doing <laughs> for the last little bit. Oh, I bet I caused a mess. Get the, get the pepper. Or the fork. Oh, she recorked it. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go for the, the pepper. Shoot. I wanted to get the pepper because the pepper's kind of far away. Uh huh. She doesn't see me. I mean, maybe she does. I don't know. But, like, I just... I need this. Shoot. Fine, I'll take this then. You did it. You got the fork. I'm working on it. God, the little music cues are wonderful. Mm-hmm. Okay. And drop it. <laughs> Does it count? No, oh, no! No. Oh. Now I'm on it. Can I just... Could I have always walked on it? I don't know. I think I literally walked up the, the plate. Oh, shoot. You can at least go up and fall if you need to. That's true. I'm trying now. I'm trying not to lose anything. At least I didn't throw it down a well. Yeah. Which I had done prior. Yeah. Um, I have thrown things down the well, and I'm proud of it. It's fine. Beautiful. Thank you. Knife, pepper, candle. Do 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 do. And I've already got the pepper. Oh, she put it back. I mean, of course she did, right? Yeah. That makes sense. You gonna go uncork the keg again? No. Okay. I don't need to. Do you want to, uh, do you want to read those? Sure. Our Toasty resubscribed for five months. I'm using my sub message to tell Steven to listen to the band Tally Hall sometime. I think they're a lot like, uh, they might be giants, and I think you guys might enjoy their stuff. Honk. Tally Hall. I hear... You hear Peggy. I hear... That's a, from... A huge, a huge amount of, of very fast geese. <laughs> That's, uh, Bear Link. I must take my leave to watch some blind Ocarina of Time shortly, but I shall return to the VO... I can read the Vodgram. Not parents. sure about it. <laughs> Before I leave, I'll give you one final Peggyism to do um, upon. Honk. Thank you, Barrelink. Thank you for summoning our Lord and Savior, Peggy. Greebobbly resubscribe for two months and said, Hi, Grandma. Hi, Grandpa. Honk. Honk. Oh, you are. Yeah, that's right. I fight back. I fight back. <laughs> Yuki Mizuno resubscribed 11 months. Oh, hey. How are you two doing today? Hi, We're Yuki. doing good. Things are going pretty good. Steven's a goose. The weird thing to say. Do you know that? <laughs> Candle and a knife. Maxis Legolas resubscribed. Uh, Thank you. Welcome. Thank you, Max. Uh oh. I think the Let's knife see. is over here. Uh oh. That's not the knife. Oh, <gasps> you broke it! And I do it again, too! Oh, no, shoot. Can she reach that? Oh, God. There's another knife. Haha, <laughs> where'd I go? You idiots. Okay. How am I going to get out of this one? Go up around the other one. It's my plan. You honked. That was a mistake. No, it's not. It's by design. <laughs> Go for it. Haha! <laughs> Bye! You got a knife! I was waiting for when I got a knife. I was just hoping it would be, you know, something other than a butter knife. You know, like the knife that they use in, um... What's the movie about the... Crocodile Dundee! That's a knife! That's what I needed. Silver Cross Fox resubscribed eight months and said, Honk! Thank you, Silver Cross Fox. You just need a candle, right? 
I need a candle. It means I got to find a candle, but I could probably do that. Where would I put a candle? There might be one up here. I'm just going to stay stealthy. Look around, see what I can find. Candle. That looks like a candle. Hmm. Perfect. Okay. And this all connects. Well... It doesn't all connect, but it kind of mostly connects. And I pro they're probably not going to make me light this, because that seems yeah. difficult and then also dangerous. We're having a, a beautiful, a beautiful dinner here. We are. Very nice. Thank you. Thank you. I made a dinner. For us? Yeah, I mean, it's not like a dinner. I didn't make a dinner. I just, I, I stole objects and placed them on a table. Yeah. Which is not the same. <laughs> Sapphire Pack says, Goose Dundee. <laughs> that's, uh, that's who I am. A romantic goose dinner. You have to wonder what possesses the goose to do all of these things. It's true. Um. Steven. I think we found the best item of the game. Easily the best item of the game. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. Oh yeah, Ryan says, uh, Speaking of food, whatever happened to the previously mentioned pie? It's true, Mal. It's true. We are, uh, we're two hours into the stream. We're gonna have to have... We're gonna have to have pie at some point. I'm really surprised he's willing to play with you just standing in the way. Yeah. <laughs> Sing us a song, you're the piano goose. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Jade says ice cream goes good with pie. Jade, no. I don't need another stream where I'm actively encouraged to leave my home and buy oh, ice cream. You, threw you get one a year. One a year, and we've already done it. Remind me in 2020. I got a. F oh, what'd you do? I stood here and I entertained them, and they threw me a flower. Oh, they're sweet. So I was telling Linda. I'm not allowed to get too close. Uh, let's see what I can do. Make the old man fall on his bum. Who old man? Probably the old man that was guarding the gate from you. Him. This dude? <laughs> boop, 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 boop. You know, he did pick up the box you were in before. So maybe you could go get in the box. Oh, the music is very serious. Oh, no. Go get in the box. Leave. What box? The box outside. Yeah, come get some. What could that be? Do you See? think that would make him fall? Yeah. Get in the box. How do I... Hey, yeah. And then when he comes back, honk, and he'll come look at it and pick it up. Did he pick it up, though? He did, and then the person who's bringing stuff came and got it, too. <laughs> yeah, Tony Hawk's pro goose skater. I was thinking Solid Snake. Do 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 can't get over this curb do 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 Honk Will I even need to? I'm in his way What is this? Honk again See he, like, picked it up before. Or maybe when he's trying to listen for you, pop out. Oh. 
He knows I'm in here. <laughs> you can't make me exit the box. Oh no, oh no, I flipped over. Oh no, oh no, my cover. <laughs> this is a. Hi, buddy. Hi, Kippies. This poor man does not know what to think. I'm actually kind of getting inside this way. A little bit. Taking this over here, don't mind me. Remember when you threw the slipper down the well? Am I getting the box stuck? Yeah. <laughs> All right, well. <laughs> That's where I'm storing my box. <laughs> What if I sneak up behind him and I honk? No. That did not work. <laughs> this is my- this is my safety box! You can box if you want to. Hmm, okay. Yeah, making him fall on his bum... That's... I'm trying to figure out what would... Hi. What would... what would do it? If we uncorked the thing and he... I don't know. That seems hard. Yeah. That seems overly difficult for what they probably want us to do. But it'd probably work? Yeah, but he doesn't come up there. Ever? Hmm. Definitely need you to leave. Definitely need you to go away. Yeah, that does not... Yeah, he would not slip yeah. on that. That is not going to work. But now I have this cork. Great. When she, fin when she realizes this, it's going to be a problem, but... Hmm. I'm gonna look for an- oh shoot. Oh no 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 Help me help me help me help me help me somebody help me help me help me help me sir help me please help me I'm just a ghost help me Jesus help me this box he's like oh I couldn't uh -huh. get him and I'm standing right here I mean I could just go for something else yeah but like at some point how are we oh no oh no this is fine look what you've done to the box the box is great the box is you can go anywhere in the box He will come up here. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm like, oh, maybe this will work. No. It won't. <laughs> Help! 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 Well, I've alarmed everyone, but I still haven't figured out how to make this guy fall. Well, try something else. Kepler, you're so warm. Oh man, if I get kicked out, I'll never be able to get back in because I left the box under the thing. <laughs> Didn't really think about that no. when I was putting it under there, but now I'm like, wait, no, this is not good. There we go. Oh, I'm safe. What's it like for them to know I'm here and can do nothing about it? <laughs> Tom said, did someone say the box? The box is the best item in the game. Next to the harmonica. 
The box will let you do anything. Kepler. But I should probably get the box out of there. Oh, actually, I can't. I don't think I can get... Can I push the box out of here? Okay. Slowly Ooh. push the box. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, the box. Look what you've oh, done. Oh, the box. Grab it. There we go. Yeah, I better leave this out here in case I need it. Yeah. Okay. Um, and he comes back. I'm still not sure what would make him fall. And don't I know. I didn't really look around this area too much. We could ignore it, I guess. There's other things that we'll we can do. A pacifier, some mail. Like if he reached down to get something, just deliver in your mail. Here you go. Is that yours? <laughs> is that I'm, I'm the new postman? Is that post goose? Post goose. Is this is this yours? Is this your letter? Is this yours? Do you need this? No. Okay. Just checking. Just want to make sure. Is that woman looking at me or the mail? You. Ma'am. Ma'am. That should not have worked. No. Huh, this thing has weight to it. Back inside! See, I got them to fall on their butt. Yeah. But he won't. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go do, like, dartboard. Okay. I think I can just get out here. Yeah. Whoop. See? Hi. Maybe you need to have the old guy being care carrying it. Yeah, but I don't know what we would do. Do the dartboard. Sorry, I gotta go. Hi. Um. See, what's my... Break it. Yeah, I need to break this. How do we break this? Oh, sorry. Please don't kick me. I'm just a goose. Nice. Oh, bye. Can you move his chair? I wonder if he hates me now. We can still be friends. What's on the back of this? Can I have this? <laughs> Good luck. I couldn't figure out how to make the man fall down. I'm sure there is a way. It may or may not rely on the on the box. 300 bits from Jam. It says not to backseat too much, but there's actually another old man. The is ring, that... the ring throwing guy. He's clearly older. Yeah. You you did this. Ugh. You put into my head that it was the guy at the front. This guy's old. He's I got it gray was the hair. Guy at the front. That, look how old he is. Thank you, Jam. <laughs> it's actually a helpful thing. <laughs> because we just struggled forever. Wait, what'd you do? Wow. We messed with that guy at the front forever. Yeah. And Jam was like, um, the guy throws darts older. And we're like, oh, wait. <laughs> this is a good point. Wait, did we steal a pint glass and drop it in the canal? Mm -hmm. And then get the toy boat. I didn't even see a toy boat. I didn't either. But the pint glass. Right there. Is this a pint glass? There's no other glasses. Except for the one over there? Well, they're the same. Are they the same? I think so. <laughs> Rats. In the canal? Good job. Is that in the... Is no, in it's the... out on the street. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, I'm just, I'm her assistant. Please let us leave. Please let the goose go. As we, that's what we do. Oh, shoot. Again. Again with the chasing, Phil. <gasps> wow. 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 And that's dangerous, I'll have you know. He's chasing you out. I'm very upset about this. Excuse me, ma'am. Could you... Please take me. Please take me. Please take pick, take me inside. Please just if you if you take me inside. Did you see me get in that time? You did. Still. 
Ma'am, don't make me do this myself. Oh. I've done it before and I will do it again. Just just get me inside the thing. I need a glass. Ma'am, please. I need your help. <laughs> oh, wait, the guy was coming out. It's wonderful. No, 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 ma'am. Ma'am. God. <laughs> you are not doing so good at that. Here we go. Got it. First off. <laughs> just wait until I. Oh, a box. Why'd you jump I out? I didn't. I, my, he automatically did that. Oh, Goose! Goose is starting to have a mind of his own. Goose, no! Okay, she didn't see that, though. Okay, she did, actually. Okay, I'm gonna just walk over here. Da, 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 da. What's that noise over there? I don't know. Don't, no, 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 hey, 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 look Just over let her here. girl put it down, and then she'll go back in with a different box, and then come back. <laughs> okay. Thank God, oh God. We got there. We got... <laughs> Goose jumped out of that box and I didn't touch it. Uh-huh. You said the canal's out, right? Yeah. For sure? Uh-huh. Okay. All right, this is my stop. Thanks. Sorry. Nothing personal. We only have so many cups. Yeah. Um. Oh, there's a toy boat. Oh, that's good. Um. Um. Ba 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 ba. Let's. You did not. Uh oh. No, no, that's mine. That's mine. That's mine. That's mine. Oh, I'm flying. I'm getting up somewhere. Oh, I don't know what just happened go, to you. Go, go, go. He's up there. You can get out without him. That was weird and great. Oh. No! Why? Why? <laughs> get out of the way. Oh, my God. Why would you do this? I was, like, flying up through the air. Go get in your box. Is it even over here? Yes. Get in it. That's so sad. <laughs> Could you bring me inside, please? Well, now you can try the boat one. Fool. Have you left your post? Oh, he slid back! Come get some of this. You idiot. You absolute idiot. <laughs> what have you done? Okay. There's one more cup. There is? Yeah. I saw it earlier. It's my last chance. If I break this one, I can't do it. Think she sees me? Okay. Yeah. Yes. Oh god. Oh god! Ah! 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 Okay, I need you to look, that's has infinite liquid in it. Yeah. Call a scientist. Yeah, there's one more oh, shoot. See it on the car? Oh yeah. I saw it earlier. This is that's my last shot. Come on. Be very careful. Do not drop this. Under no circumstances can I drop this. Well, you made it here. Focus on the other... Okay. Okay. Don't... 
don't touch me. <laughs> so help me God. Okay. That's right. Go look if you want. He's going up the stairs. Yeah. Keep going up the stairs. Go, 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 go. Thank God. All right. Where's the canal? Keep going. Back. I'm yeah, right there. No, keep going up. Or maybe it's right here. It's right here. Does this count as the canal? Mm-hmm. Be Don't gone! Fall, though. Oh. But I did it! You did it. And now it's your problem. <laughs> Holy crap. Holy crap. That was... That was hard. That was so hard. Six month resub from Anthony Bell says, uh, I don't know where the sub came from. Doesn't matter. You got you got a sub. And Mouse got another follow. Congrats on double plus. So when are we gonna When are we When are we gonna pie? Whenever you want. I could have some pie. Yeah. I think I'm going to get some pie. Will you get me pie? Well, what kind of pie do you want? Oh, no. <laughs> we have pumpkin pie. I know. We have apple pie. I know. And we have chocolate pie. I know. She's putting a goat or a goose. <laughs> but ice cream, Steven. No. Ask me next year. <laughs> One ice cream stream a year. That's it. Can't do two. I'm going to have some chocolate pie. Okay. What what kind of pie would you like? Oh, I can't. Are you asking me to bring you all of the pies? <laughs> Fossick says you could do a poll for the type of pie you eat. That's true. If you would just be like a normal person say, hmm, I want this, then I will get it for you. I got the boat. Um, I'll have pumpkin. Well, now it's my turn. So now you get the pie. <laughs> Are we done in this area? Drop a bucket on the burly man's head. What? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Kepi just came upstairs. Yeah, now you have to get pie. Because it's, 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 uh -huh. it's my turn. What burly man? I don't know. Who is burly man? Also, where is there a place to drop a bucket? Because this well, is the bucket. Well, I did knock the bucket down, so... From up there, it was up above those tomatoes. Yeah. Sir? Maybe they'll put it back. They all want to put the bucket back. Where it can be easily dropped on someone's head. Okay, that's a good point. Is this what you want? Honk. Yeah, they're very anxious to do that. Maybe. What? She's got to get... Yo, you went the wrong way, honey. You were standing <laughs> next to it. I'll go get the pie. I'll take chocolate pie. Okay, you want raspberries on it? Yeah! I forgot we had that. Tom says, do you want to know who the burly man is? The only person I can think of who would be the burly man would be the guy at the gate. But I can't imagine he would chase us all the way through there now. Because in this area, the only men is the old man and then the guy at the gate. So I guess that's, I guess that's just the burly man. I'm going to assume that that's the burly man. Which means I have to somehow... That seems hard. Yes, please. Thank you. Coffee sounds great. Um, yeah, that means I'm going to have to honk. Get him to chase me somehow. But in the, into there? But then to drop the bucket, I'll have to be in a completely different spot. Huh. Okay. I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll try. I'll figure it out. Let's see. Let's see how far we get. 
But Tom's comment was still helpful because it inspired me to think about the fact that there's really only two guys in this area. <laughs> if it's not one, it's probably the other. You don't see me? Okay. Yeah, you are burly, man. So I gotta get you over there. Okay. How fast are you? Are you following me? You're not even... Okay, he's, he's on his way. He's on his way. I need... No, no, no. Come here. If I go through here, he'll open the door. Oh god, now everyone's in here. I don't like it when everyone's in here. The, the thing is, I've... G okay, he's going after that. He's going to have to, like... Sit here somehow for me to be able to do this. And... And that's what seems hard. Whew. I might be able to just honk and he'll come up to me, too. Everyone seems really upset now that all that crap's over there, which is reasonable. All right, so... I don't... Mm, I feel like he's going to have to, like, fall. What? No. Unless you want... Oh, God. Oh, God! Shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. Hmm. Hmm. He could drop the bucket on my head from where we are right now. We are in reverse positions. <laughs> huh. Yeah, I can take these tomatoes. And just make the world's biggest mess out of them. Now you start cleaning that up. Oh god. Oh god. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Oh, he's cleaning him up. <gasps> he's doing it! This is working! Gotcha, you son of a gun! Did that count? Got it. Oh man, he's covered in he's covered in blood. <laughs> Did I do this to you? Does this make you mad? Does this upset you? Does this upset you? Hi. I'm right here. I'm a little bird snake. What's wrong, buddy? Huh? Do I upset you? Also, it looked like I may have been able to grab his, um... Uh shoelaces, honestly. It looked like he got close enough. I, I think I saw that briefly, but it was very brief. And now I'm real curious if I can do that. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Please. Please pay me attention. Come here. It's got... Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm very stuck. <laughs> Please, sir. I did it! I did... I ended one of his shoelaces. I got the, the, the thing on the head. 
and now I'm just trying to figure out if I can get his shoelaces, because I definitely undid one of his shoelaces. Hey, bud. Why don't you come here? Why don't you come here? Ah! What? What was that? I was trying. To, oh, is it just this? Oh, did you need one of these? Oh my God! I know, I know, I know. I didn't even know I could do all of that. He fell like face first onto the the cement. I feel a little bad, but not like that bad. Anyway, it's technically your turn. Um, <laughs> I've done all of the things now. Okay. And by, I mean, I only had the one thing, but mm -hmm. the um, ouch. To do as well, lock uh -huh. the grounds, keep out of the garden, and we already did these. So yeah, you just have to move into like the next area. Okay. It was great, Mal. It was, it was great. Gra it brought me. It brought me um, unforetold joy. Unforetold. Yeah. You could not foretell it. Look at that. So Mal's apple pie. Yes. I've got chocolate pie with raspberries. Kepler's in the tub. Is real good. Is it? It's real good. With the raspberry? Yeah. Mm. Look, I'm in the trash. It's real good. No. Chocolate pie is good. It's just pudding, but it's good. Read the Nintendo Painter gifted sub to Bodacious Cowboy. That's Jeff. Puts Jeff at eight months. Thank you, Reed. And then also 300 bits from um, Max. Max S. Legalis. Who says, uh, Was wondering if y'all remembered the two cursed black and white fan art comics, Jovi and, Jogi and, Jovi and Peggy versus For Gothics, I sent during Extra Life, and what y'all thought uh, everyone but Chaz missed them during the stream. Uh, I saw them. I saw them in... Uh, because what I did is, after the stream ended... Even though it's already late and I should I should have slept, I just went and looked through that hashtag, the extra life hashtag, so I got to see everything, and it was fantastic. So thank you, and thank you to all of our artists who submitted uh, fan art, um, stream art during the uh, extra life stream, because it was fantastic. Thank you, Max. Diddy Egg says, Stephen, do you like pie now? Uh, over the years, I've I've been slowly turned on to some pies by Mao. I would not say I like pie as a, in a general sense, but certain pies, yes. Apple pie, chocolate chocolate pie, which is just chocolate pudding. It's <laughs> being honest. Hmm. Ma'am. I want to eat a lot of this. There's two of those. There's two chocolate pies? Mm hmm Mamma mia. That was the appropriate response. Wow, well-timed. Mamma mia, there's two chocolate pies? There are. 588 bits from Mr. Game Boy 18. Yum, pie. I'm more of a cake person, but chocolate pie sounds really good. Also, you've been turned on by pie? Interesting. Hey, pie. That's all you get. Um... Cho there's multiple different types of chocolate pies, and when Mao asked me what pies to make, she was always going to make apple pie and pumpkin. She asked if I wanted any other pies, and I was like, you know what? I actually had a, I had a chocolate pie in college. Don't know anything about it, but it was good. Maybe you can make one of those. She said, sure. And this is definitely not anything close to what I had in college. Well, but I it's asked also you if it good. was whipped or not, and you said no. Yeah, and it wasn't. I thought I could mail this letter. You tried. I tried. You're not tall enough. No. Um, yeah, but this is also good. This, the consistency of this is basically pudding. And this is wonderful. But it's not the same as the thing I had in college. And I don't know what it was I had, honestly. But it was one of the first times I ever had pie. And I was like, oh, pie. This did is it have good. any meringue? No. What did it look like? Pie. 
Like that? No. What did it look like? It was like black. And it was taller. And the the big thing is that this the consistency of this is like pudding. And the consistency of that pie was really firm. Yeah. But I don't know what it was. This is like chocolate pudding pie. Yeah, that's what that is. Mm-hmm. Oh, really good. Oh, Diddy Egg, Diddy Egg says, I bet I could make you the best apple pie you've ever had. I tried to use South Carolina apples from Oconee County. I bet it would be good. But I am legally obligated to say that the best apple pie I've ever had is from my wife. But also, legit, Mao's is really good. So, yeah. Like, she's been working on it for many years and tweaking things, and it is very good. It's a it's a Dutch apple. The crumble on top is is amazing. So, but also there can be many good pies. Mm -hmm. It's a good thing to remember. Uh, and the world needs more dessert. So. Okay, I'm stuck. And Zach asks, doesn't your grandmother make really good pie? Yes, uh, my uh, my dad's mom is a pie maker and makes all sorts of pie. And there was a, there's a vlog where she very famously, um, she had, what, what was the exact thing? You might have to help me. She had, she went in and she, they, they found out she had breast cancer mm -hmm. and they were like, you, you, you have breast cancer um, you know, what do you want to do about it? And she's like... Well, they had to do a full double yeah. vasectomy. Yeah, they, they had to, you know, completely remove her breasts. Mm -hmm. And she's like, well, as long as it doesn't take too long, because I gotta get home and make pies. And that's what she did! She had the surgery, and she went home, and she made, like, 30 pies. And I'm like, that's my grandma! <laughs> it's just what she had to do. Diddy Egg says, uh, the reason why South Carolina apples from Oconee County is because I live in Columbia, but uh, go to school at Clemson. I see. Always nice to have more uh, more, more South Carolina folk around. And we have a few. But it's always nice to hear from, you know, familiar places. I don't know what to do. Penguin Frog says, uh, didn't she actually tell that oh, story on the vlog? There we go. Um, no, I think when that happened... I told it because she would have still been like in West Virginia, but she has told stories on the vlog. So Kepler, what are you doing? Kepler born and raised. Cheers. Same Kepler. What are you doing? Okay. Saunders says born in Anderson. All the, all the South Carolina folks coming out of the woodworks. I did it. Congrats. Now I get to eat pie. Hmm. Did you mute your mic? Yes. So people wouldn't hear you chewing? Yes. I'm not that courteous. Uh, steal the beautiful miniature golden bell. Oh, that's it. Sorry, I wasn't watching. And now I'm like, where are we? <laughs> this is a miniature set of everything. What? This is bizarre. This is so cool. And it's especially cool because I wasn't paying attention to what you were doing. So I just looked up and the world got smaller. And I'm like, what's happening? No, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah. No, 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 no. a miniature, miniature. Oh, I don't like that. So there's the bell. It's really important that I honk while I do this. I feel like I'm going to crush myself. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. 
Bell! I did it. There's a new to-do list item. And take it all the way back home. Oh, because at the beginning, there's that, that pit of bells. Oh, if you run with it, it makes noise, so it attracts everyone. And the music's getting crazy. So where were you? This is so weird. I guess this will reveal where it was you came from. That was a bit from Luke a lot who says Metal Goose Solid. So this this is the stealth section, I guess, because when you run, you bring the Oh, I see where we were. Okay, I understand. Luke, thank you for the bits, and thank you for uh at least subconsciously ticking me off a little bit about what I should be doing in this particular spot. So can I Oh, this is like locked. Oh. Alright, let's do it. Let's do it. I'm all in on this. I am all in on this. I am taking this home. They're really concerned about this bell. Like, the bell is important. Is this like... This is, like, important to their society or something. There he goes! Catch that goose! I think we're good. Things are getting dicey. I can't go that way. Oh, everything's been locked, so I have to go the long way home. Oh boy. Oh boy. You are definitely incentivized to walk. This is the stealth section. I think I've terrorized this town. She glued her vase back together. This is not good. Does this get open? Is he coming back? Yeah. So I'm thinking what I need to do. I have an idea. So I think what I'm gonna do. I have to I'm I'm like basically training myself not to run here. Yeah. I wonder if she'll see me. The answer is yes. Oh! Ah! She fixed it! Oh no! Give me that bell. Give me that bell. Give me that bell. You don't understand. That bell is mine! That's not where it goes! Oh! That makes things a little easier. <laughs> jangle, 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 jangle. Alright. Bring it, br slow it down, goose, slow it down. We, uh, we've made some enemies in this section. This is also where I learned to fly. It's nice to know that in case of emergency. Oh. <gasps> Be careful. Shoot. No.
Music's getting crazy. <gasps> oh god! Oh no! There's so many! He wants the bell, but he's still frightened. <laughs> Slow it down. Oh god, the gardener pissed off so long ago. Where is he? Oh my god. The goose was the murderer and aviary attorney, so sequel question when you're gonna get... The goose was the murder and aviary attorney, he was the one that had the gurney, he put the people on the, the... I cannot think of trying to play a game about a bell. I can't think about what the hell I'm gonna say because of the bird right now. I'm trying to do something and not do a foul. The gardener's in the way. I can go this way unless he blocked it, and I think he didn't, so I'm gonna go this way. I can't think so straight. I'm sorry, I'm a little late on the rhymes. <laughs> also, pro tip, um, don't straight up just read the thing and use that as the rhyme because you will get stuck trying to rhyme the word attorney. And as soon as I landed on that, I was like, you've made a grave error. Um, you cannot rhyme anything with attorney. And I was like, gurney? Journey, yeah. As soon as I say that... As soon as I say that you can't, people will be like, well, here's a list of all of the words you could have. Do you need help? Why do I need help? So you can finish your pie. I think I have it. Yeah. I think I just have to go over here. Also, it doesn't make noise in the water. By the way, that was 5,000 bits for Mr. Game Boy <laughs> <laughs> Who has a knack for, for triggering the alerts when I'm not able to able think, to think mm -hmm. at all? It's incredible. The goose was the murderer an aviary attorney. <laughs> I did use the word gurney. Serious question. When are you guys going to Pax East again? Also, Run Goose Run. Uh, I do not know. We were there in 2018. Mm -hmm. But I'm not sure exactly when we will be there next. Tom says, you made Donna and I want pie. You should get pie. <coughs> I recommend it. You did it. I did it. I think I get to enjoy pie now. Yeah. <sighs> Yay. Mr. Gameboy, thank you for the bit. <laughs> My brain was like, what? <laughs> Read? The goose was the murderer in Aviary. I mean, that would line up, right? And introducing a goose as the goose. Mm. Pudding. <laughs> that pie is too rich. Incorrect. Did the raspberry help? It was good. Cut the sweetness a little bit? Mm-hmm. The apple is my favorite. I have to make another one tomorrow. Well, yeah. You know how sad Dan would be. I know, if there was no apple pie. He would be crushed. My throat made a strange noise. The pumpkin's really good, too. Hmm. Man, that's a good pie. 
the graham cracker crust with that is really good. I don't think it would be as good with a traditional crust. Very short. D Scoot asks, did you film the pie video? We did. We did. There is a pie video coming. There's new things to do, Mal. Now you get to see the full list. Ah, What's to the picnic. left and right, though? More to do as well. To do quickly. Reset to give this a go. Complete the garden to-do list before the church bell rings. Ah, I see. Ah. That's hard. Neat. Cabbage picnic. <laughs> Speed run list. Hmm. I need to go. The pie? Yeah, I just want more, and that's not good. Like, I should not just keep eating pie, you know? Yeah. Like, people should, like, eat pie and then stop. Can I not grab the cabbage? I have to roll it. Well, they're post-game things, so they have to make them harder. What well, is the specific goal? Cabbage picnic. <laughs> so just one cabbage or all of them? I think all of them. That was great. Also, also game is great. Playing soccer. Untitled Goose Game is is, uh, is really good. Obviously, it's short. We beat mm -hmm. it in under three hours. Don't go in the lake. Don't go in the lake. Don't go in the lake. And we, we knew what we were doing in the first section. So we probably killed no. a little time. Cabbage. But it's very, it's very funny, and I think the, it's nice because it's a... It strikes me as a very good, accessible game for maybe an audience that doesn't normally play games. Oh, I did it! So, like, if you have family, maybe in town for Thanksgiving, there's people that, you know, they don't normally play games. This is probably a good game to introduce them to. Bad sign. Good party game. Yeah. Just because, like, It's very easy to understand. You can't lose, which I think is... I think it's a, that's a, that alone is one of the big turn-offs for people that don't play games. It's like... It's got to be fairly simple controls. And then people don't want to feel like they're losing and have to start over all the time. And as long as that's happening... No goose death. Goose don't want none of this anti-goose propaganda. Like, everyone conceptually understands the idea of, like, the goose can take the thing. And it's still a game, and there's parts of it that, you know, were a little difficult. I did it! Make the shop scales go ding. It's also nice that there's a bunch of extra little things added. So you can get those. Shop scales. <laughs> so Dark Souls is a perfect game for people who don't play games. Well. Well. Biomed 8 Nuju says, Yay! I've been a fan of the YouTube channel for quite a bit now, so I'm thrilled when I find y'all alive. Happy wiggle dance. I can't wiggle too much because I got coffee. This is my... This is like a slow wiggle dance. I made the shop scales go ding. You're just knocking these things out, Mal. Go for it. Diddy Egg says, no, Ocarina is the best first-time game. And then Sonic 2. Ocarina be a pretty hard sell. Ocarina's a little complicated. 
to introduce someone to video games. Sonic 2 is a pretty good one, though. Yeah. I think Sonic... Actually, Sonic's pretty good. Sonic... Sonic would be easier as an introductory video game than Mario. I think. Mario is more complicated than Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah. I feel I feel safe in making that, that assumption. Comparing Sonic the Hedgehog... Like, 1 and 2 versus, like, Mario Brothers... It's it's easier, like Jolly Roger Gay says, you get you get way more hits in Sonic. It's easy to quickly understand the concept of you die when you don't have rings. So you make you have to make sure that you have a ring. And go right. There's no power ups. Without bringing in the whole supersonic thing. Well, I mean, there's, I guess there are, power, there's like speed and invincibility and stuff, but that's not the same as like Mario getting fire, fire, fire. But if we're comparing like Sonic 2, Sonic 2 would be an easier game for someone, I think. The shields. Yeah, but that's not the same thing as like Mario getting a, a power up and having to use the power up. So. Yeah, the Sonic series would be a really good introduction. But still... Goose. <laughs> Go Goose are the greatest. Yeah, I mean, Goose... This would be an easier first game for people. Yeah, that's a good way of putting it. Sonic's power-ups are passive. Which is true. Jezreza says, just play Sekiro. Well, don't miss the next first 20 stream. Can I get my the hard thing, back? The hard thing about Sonic would be needing Chaos Emeralds to get the true ending of the game. Also, Labyrinth Zone and Sonic 1. Yeah, but, I mean, if you're just having someone, like, play a game. Please give me the bow back. There can be little, extra little intricacies, but... <laughs> When's the, the goose gonna steal that giant bell? <laughs> you got your bow back now? I got the bow back. Oh no! Brandon says, I think if you're introducing someone to gaming, casual is definitely the way to go. A long RPG is a hard first time. Yeah. Especially depending on the type of RPG too, because some RPGs are, uh... They're rough. They're a rough start. Also, we had 200 bits. We had 200 bits from Wandering Stars. Thank you, Wandering Stars. I appreciate that. No! I do just says, when is the God of War first 20? Uh, that would imply that I plan to do it as the first 20 and not a full LP. And I make no promises or announcements. But God of War is high on my list of games that I think would fit a streaming format a solo streaming format, well. So, we'll see what happens in 2020. Steal the old man something. <laughs> Just have someone play Dark Souls as their first game. Just shove them right into the deep end and let them drown. <laughs> Kirby would be a solid series to introduce someone into gaming. Yes! Yeah, Master Starman is right. The Kirby's... And it is, I think. Um... Especially some of them. Some of them are a little harder than others, but there's... It's a fun game. It's a colorful game. It doesn't feel threatening. It's also co-op, and co-op games just in general, I think, are a really great way to introduce people to gaming, because you get to play with someone who is a gamer. The guys still have... Still have the stuff on his butt. <laughs> now I have hiccups. I'm sorry. I says, I can see heavier games like To the Moon being a good intro to gaming as well, if they want that kind of experience. Yeah, just that and walking sims in general. And I know that there's sometimes disdain within the gaming community for games like that. But they are still games. And uh, if if that is someone's introduction to gaming, then I'm all for it. Um, and also, if that ends up being what they like, 
go for it. You know, a lot of the a lot of those sorts of games like Walking Dead, etc., they basically play out like shows that you get to make the decisions for. Shape shifting de- detective, which we played last week, mm-hmm. same thing. So. And Savannah's right. A good story always grabs people. Experience the games you want to play. It's true. <laughs> Pachi says, aren't we forgetting the ultimate casual introductory game in Wii Sports? Honestly, I, and there, I don't know how much realistic data is on this. But, like, hands down, Wii Sports is probably more... Res- it's pro- I bet... Wii Sports brought more people into gaming than any other game ever before. Like, seriously. I don't know if there's any data on that, but, like, if that's if that's the bar... I mean, either that or, like, Candy Crush. But, like, if that's the bar... People are saying Tetris. Maybe Tetris. And, like, yeah, there's arguments you can make for Tetris or arcade games or things like that, but, like, Wii Sports is so big, and I just think of the demographic that would not have jumped into arcade games. It would probably, arguably, if not jumped into Tetris, and that is the older generation. Like, there are so many um, retirement homes that have... Wii Sports. Mallory's grandma was on a Wii Sports bowling league. And that's amazing. So, like, Brandon says, Wii Sports, 82 million copies. That's the thing. Is there any realistic data on this? Like, probably not. But that's... That, and then, like, obviously, Tetris is super important. And, uh... Certain arcade games... But I'm, I'm gonna put my I'm gonna put my hat into Wii Sports. Because for a lot of people, that's that was how they played it. Pira Zadon says, uh, "Didn't Wii Sports come with the Wii? Hence the numbers." Uh, yeah, but I I mean, people still played it. Like, would it? And if you're if you're coming at it from the perspective of would it have sold that well on its own as a standalone game? I mean, probably not. But the fact that people could buy a system and have what for them was a system seller is a big deal. Wii Sports was hand down like the best pack in ever. I don't think there's there. I don't I don't know if there's even any other games um, that could come close to that. And there's been good pack in games, but like. Wii Sports took, like, everything by storm. I can still remember, um... I can still remember going to... We went to a concert. Me and Austin went to a concert because they were doing... At the... It was at the House of Blues, and it, it's, it was a bunch of bands, and then Nintendo... And they were traveling around, and, like, there was a concert, but then also you could play the Wii, like, a few months before it came out. And it was, like, such a big deal. I really enjoyed it. What's your objective right now? I don't know. Oh, they fixed that brick so you can't jump in the... Wait, what do you mean you don't know? Oh, I'm just playing around while you're... Oh, okay. (laughs) <laughs> Sorry. I wanted to take the bell back. Because you didn't get a chance to do uh-huh. it. Uh-huh. Have you dropped it? They haven't made me drop it. Okay. I dropped it once to try if I could do something. Mm-hmm. But they haven't made you drop it? No. Is the thing open or closed? It's closed. It was open before, right? I think so. See? That's weird. Because when I did it, I went through that... Uh Uh-oh. Oh, no! What are you supposed to do? Oh, I don't know. Open it yourself? Maybe. 
Because th that was open for me. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? Jam says, it's cool that you can take multiple bells. I wonder if they render them all, like if, or if they just disappear. I wonder if you just kept doing this, if they just pile and then start falling <laughs> over. But yeah, that gate was definitely open, so... Yeah. Ah, oh, no. Run like Yoshi avoiding the IRS. <laughs> what are your thoughts on the the Switch Fit, uh, the Ring Fit Adventure? Uh, it looks neat. We do not own it. So I, d I don't have a whole lot of opinions. But it looks interesting. We might we might pick it up whenever uh, when it comes down in price a little bit. I know Tom did a uh, Tom did a stream in it where he wore uh, <laughs> Mamma Mia. That's exactly yes, where he wore uh, <laughs> Mamma Mia. He wore some interesting pants. Some interesting pants. Five hundred and ten bits from Mr. Game Boy eighteen. So next week, uh, you guys are playing Ori and the Blind Force, right? <laughs> Just J K J K. Either way, I can't wait for Mal to play it, and I would love to see it as a stream, it being about eight hours long, so two or three streams. Uh, it is it is on my admit, some, admittedly somewhat long list of potential streams to do. So, that's not like a guarantee or a promise, it's just I, I do have it written down as a pot uh, potential idea. There's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of uh, different things that I think would be very fun to do streams of. And that's one of them. Haha, -ha, I've escaped her. And Nerdy Revelry says, Did Mount ever watch Aviary Attorney? No. It's basically... a attorney game. Yeah. But everyone is a bird. Uh-huh. And it takes place in France. And I got to mispronounce a lot of stuff. No, don't throw it over the thing! Don't throw it over the thing! Don't! No, 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 no! Three good. Three good. <laughs> Tom wore Mamma Mia pants. <laughs> yes. Mamma Mia! Here we go again! Meowth asking the important questions. Will you be traveling a lot next year, too? <gasps> no. Not if I can help it. <laughs> I, uh... We're, we're very happy to be back. Um, two international trips in one year was uh, a lot. And, like, I understand why it happened. Because China was planned before we even planned Japan. And then Japan would only work for everyone when we did it. And that's uh -huh. how we wound up with two. But, like, it was it's, it's too hard on us. It's... Especially with... The fact that, like, we barely balance things when we're not going anywhere. So when we go too many places, things just fall apart. So. Tom says, I wore Mamma Mia pants? <laughs> yeah, in your Ring Fit Adventure stream. The pink pants. The pink pants. Because I said, uh... I said, he wore some pants that were... And then the alert came, and it was Mario saying Mamma Mia, and I was like, yeah, those. Mamma Mia pants. It's, uh... They're good pants. They're good pants. Stop! You guys should visit Canada next, preferably around Lake Superior. It's beautiful. We were in Canada last year. We were in Canada, um, because we were... When we did Make-A-Wish, um, that was in... Vancouver. So we did get to see Vancouver, and that was the first time either Mao or, uh, or myself had been in Canada. And that was fun. Um, obviously, there's plenty more Canada to see. Uh, John wants us to come visit him and Reese. And we'll do that at some point. When it's not covered in snow, probably. Because yeah. um, I don't want to do that. <laughs> Basically. Tom, thanks for your butt. You can just pull that out of context. And just if you need like a pick me up, you can just pull that up on your phone. 
You have to come back to Canada for Tim Hortons. Correct. Yeah. I got a bell. <laughs> you did it. You did it all by yourself. Tom says, no problem, man. <laughs> My butt's available. <laughs> I did it. And then the credits just scroll again? Okay. So anytime you bring that bell back. I want more pie. I know, but we shouldn't. I know. I had a pie. You had a pie. We had a pie. We should not. Yeah. We should not. It was enough to make... I can move over, like, some of the pie, so I have another clean pie pan. Yeah. ba ba da ba da ba da ba ba Ad space? <laughs> Are you taking out ads on your buns? Is that what that's supposed to be? <laughs> or your advertising for... Your ad here. Or your ad here. This one is cheaper because you don't see this. Well, never mind. Um, how do you... Oh, you can just... Oh, you can hold plus and zoom up, zoom on through. The song is an ad! Press Y to honk. That just restarts. Do you want to continue going after some of the things? Nah. You done? Yeah. I enjoyed this game. I did too. It was fun going back and forth. It reminded me of the Mario LPs that we do. Switching off on tasks. Yeah. That was fun. Did you check uh, to see if anyone is on? It's only 11. Yeah. And you opened Gmail. That's not what I expected. I was looking at something else. Jepson. Oh, Jepson's playing uh, a Zelda game. We'll send folks over to, to, to Jepson. You can watch Jepson play a Zelda game. Yeah. Folks, um, thank you so much for 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 joining us. Uh, this actually ended a little bit sooner than uh, than I thought it would, and there's more stuff to do to you know go after 100% completion. Yeah. But uh, I enjoyed what we played. Game is good, and like we were talking about, like it's a really good introduction to games for people. I think. Yeah. Because it's just. But it's also so different that yeah. people that are gamers, yeah, will enjoy it. Mm -hmm. That's one of the reasons I really liked it. Jolly Roger Gay gifted sub to Honk Hill. <laughs> that made me smile. I'm trying to think of ways to... What's our raid message to pro, Jepson? Pro geese and geese accessories. Uh, hmm. Chat, come, come up with a good... I mean, Honk's giving is pretty on the nose, yeah, too. Yeah, it is. That's true. Uh, also got four month resub from Explosive Joseph, who says, Four months, woo, love y'all. Also, because of my name, boom. <laughs> Joseph is explosive. Honk's giving. Honk's giving. You. Or Honk's giving you. Yeah, throw in the you. It's only three extra letters. Folks, um, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, sincerely, uh, <laughs> sincerely appreciate you being here. Uh, we will be back on um, Tuesday. Tuesday for breakfast stream. Tuesday for breakfast stream. And also, pay attention to Mal's channel tomorrow. What? Is this? If you're uh, if you're looking, what is that? Do you have like? Oh. You had video off. Yeah, I guess. Uh, pay attention to Mal's channel tomorrow if you're interested in new paintings, especially ones that are based on Link's Awakening. All right, I'm <laughs> uh, gonna go ahead and send you over to Josh Jepson. Do 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 do. Raid messages hashtag Thank honks you, everyone. giving you. Spoilers, Steven. Get excited. We are sending folks over to see Josh play Zelda. Thanks, folks. See you on Tuesday for breakfast stream. Raid sent. <laughs>